<laughs> I pull out my longbow. Why do you guys give him such crap for that? It's such a good I thing to do. I break, I it's break the down the door. He says it every time. It's so funny. I kick down the door. <laughs> We kick down, kick the, down door. the door. I'm picturing Literally. one. I'm picturing one of these days, Carlisle like meticulously lock picking the door, and then all of a sudden, he, over his shoulder, Drothgar, Drothgar, or Mister Hez just like takes his takes his boot and bam, kicks the door. I love open. how you still yeah. refer to Crust as Mister Hez. Well, yeah, Hez. he said to he said to refer to him as Mister Hez. I'm only being polite. This is true. Facts. Where is she? I started my stream, but I'm just on my starting soon page, so. Who goes there? Tony's way ahead of me. I don't even have that. I just um, boom. I'm it's, streaming. It's David. Mr. Hez. It's David. David's not here. No, I, I'm. David? I'm David. No, you're Mr. Hez. <laughs> I am the captain now. <laughs> Look at me. Look at me. I forgot how we ended off, and it was it was a nice surprise. Loading no. back in. Loading this in, yeah. No. And you're like, oh yeah, right, we're about to die. <laughs> well, it's my, Rosa. It's, it's my turn to do the recap this week anyway, so you didn't even have to remember. Yo, where's David? This is he's, unexpected. He's too busy talking to that girl that he met, probably. Who? Oh, yeah! No, I haven't even met a girl. What? <laughs> Meg, is that you? <laughs> Meg, is that you? <laughs> oh, is this the one that, that he um, refused to pay $50 to talk to and tried to find her on Bumble? Hey. <laughs> yeah, I, I, no girl's worth $50. Wait, what? <laughs> no girl's facts. worth $50. <clears throat> this is pull out my longbow. Can I shoot her? <laughs> oh, David's typing. <laughs> Long go, longbow go twang. Clearly. This is dropping a duke. <laughs> Man, that is one important poop. <laughs> Yo, David. Dropping Yo. a duke. <laughs> I dropped a huge duke today. Man, I had to flush the toilet twice. I gotta turn Shane down. As Pinch well. off that loaf. Shane, can you say something? Hello. Okay. Is that better? Is that better? Yeah, I'm just I gotta I'm just adjusting everyone's volumes so that everyone's on like the same level. Am I the most important voice you're hearing right now? You're always the most important. Colin, can you say <laughs> sentences or words? Um today <clears throat> I went outside and laid on my deck and it was very nice. Oh, can I lay on your deck? Of course. Oh, baby. <laughs> you can do it. You can do it. Sorry. What? What's up? You're just. So I got into. I'm in Alex's family, like D and D, or not D and D, Age of Empires chat now. Like in the group chat that I have with her sisters and her brother-in-law and her cousin. Don't ask me how I'm in this chat already. <laughs> it's a. It's a whole thing. But anyway. So they're like aggressively trying to make her uncomfortable, right? Because that's just what you do. When you're related to somebody, and let's just say it's uh, it's uh, it's working, but on me, I don't know. Because <laughs> the thing you have to understand is her brother-in-law and sister, her sister, they got they got engaged after being dating for three months. Oh, <laughs> so yeah. wow. it's like yes. so they're just like, yeah, oh, Craig, you're going up to Allison tomorrow. That's cool. So it won't be long until the wedding bells are ringing. <laughs> I'm just like. Oh man, here we go already. What planet do you live on? Yeah. Earth. Oh my goodness. Yeah. 
Where's David, man? He's it's his turn. We can't we actually can't play until David's here. Oh, like it's his fit. Oh, okay. Isaac's dog is so cute. What the heck? What? I said Isaac's what? dog is so cute. Isaac got a dog? Yeah, he got a dog. It's so is, cute. Is this on the Facebooks? That's on the Instagrams. I don't use Facebook. Oh. Well, I don't use Instagram, so. Hmm. I don't even follow you on Instagram, don't you? Because I don't use it. Yeah, April 21st, 2019. Yeah. That's what I've Just turning off my switch. Yo, David, get your booty in here. He chose the worst time to drop a dookie. Right? Well, I mean, when you gotta go, you gotta go. No. You hold it for D&D. &D. The entire time? Because I count at least three of us getting up in the middle of combat to go poop. No, we don't talk about that. <laughs> we, don't gotta, we don't gotta worry about that. Hello? David? Hello? About damn time, David. Did you, did you not hear my... <laughs> <laughs> he, he made it. You gotta, you gotta do that every single time somebody comes. No, <laughs> no, no. I know it'll annoy some people. Me, okay, myself yeah, included. Beautiful. That's beautiful. Did you guys not hear my, my beautiful uh, note when I entered the chat? Oh, we did. It was horrifying. All right. No beautiful note. I didn't hear it. Are you guys ready? Oh. Yeah. Are I'm, you ready? I, I've been ready, I'm ready forever. Yeah. We're just waiting on David to drop his dude. All right. Well, before we begin, uh, Zach, Zach, it is your turn. Okay. For the recap. To, uh, Zach, to recap. recap. Let's hear it. Yeah, hit us, boy. All right. I had to write this out to remember. <laughs> oh, boy. Last time on D&D &D with the boys, after successfully defeating Glassstaff, the party finds a note addressed to Yarno Albrecht. Carlisle remembered the, bleh, that Sildar was looking for an Yarno. The, par the party decided to confront Sildar and discovered that Yarno and Glassstaff were one in the same. After being presented with multiple quests and a rousing bagpipe performance from Drothgar, the party presses on to Cragmaw Castle. After arriving... After arrival, Carlisle and Yoshi scout out the castle, and the party decided to sneak in through a side entrance. I need glasses. After navigating the castle, the party's progress is halted by a locked iron door. Carlisle breaks his lockpick and overhears a, a muffled but heated conversation behind said door. <clears throat> Mr. Hez decided to turn into a spider and discovered a drow bugbear and an unconscious dr gundren on the other side. After proceeding at Drothgar's behest, uh, before proceeding at Drothgar's behest, Carlisle peeks behind a curtain to meet uh, to meet eye to eye with a hobgoblin. During the fight, more and more enemies appear from every crack, crevice, and doorway. Goblins, bugbears, hobgoblins, drow, and owl bears. Oh my! The party has alerted the horde. Oh my! The party has alerted the horde. I love it. All right, <laughs> you've alerted the horde. All right, um. We cannot let Shane and Zach do recaps side <laughs> by side. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, well, next week, we next week Shane it can be anybody. Next week, no. Last yeah, last we week we Shane. had. Did we have Shane last time? Yeah, oh, we did. Yeah, yeah. I was like a two second recap. All right. <laughs> did we <laughs> recap like two weeks before or something? Yeah. Like that? <laughs> <laughs> um. All right. So. Uh, we, we kind of have to open off with a bang, so, um... The first person to act, as we are mid-battle, King Grawl, bloody, looking like he's barely standing. Um, but the same could be said for Drothgar. <laughs> yeah. Um, things are bad, very bad. 
What will we do? What will you do? <laughs> Kill Drothgar. You are the it is your turn. What would you like to do? I need to get rid of uh of King Grawl. Okay. Pretty badly, so I'm gonna Put you. Okay. And I'm raging still. Yep. All right. Great sorting him. Yeah, you are. Uh, gotta, gotta get. Where? Where's my character? <laughs> where's where's right. my character? Um. Hold up. One sec. One sec. One sec. One sec. Gja! Oh Damn no! It. You I'm swing and it clangs <laughs> against the wall, not hitting anything. Uh, it, you, you had a hard time. You had to kind of climb on top of a. Uh, Climb on top of, um, <laughs> what's his name? Crust. Mr. Uh, but it didn't go very well. Yeah, and I sneezed while, while trying to, trying to slash him. So you can't finish the, uh, your turn here, so I'm guessing you want to move back? Yes, please. Now, I'm <laughs> well, gonna give you, I'm gonna, back, I'm gonna help you out. So, so, if you moved only here, oh no, that's, if you, so, hmm. Here's your problem. To get back <laughs> here... King Grawl can take a swing at you. Oh. If you move back here, King Grawl and uh, the Drow can take a swing at you. Oh. So what would you like to do? Well, what if I just moved right here? <laughs> you can't finish your space. Oh, I guess if you mount... Um, if you mount Yoshi, or not Yoshi, if you mount... <laughs> can I hop on you mount and Mr. crush you? Has. If you if you mount crust, then you're good. I'm I'm mountain crust. <laughs> All right, <laughs> we're in this crust. We're in this together. All right, <laughs> Yoshi, you're up. There are goblins all around you. Oh shoot! Um, where am I again? All right, I'm right there. You're right. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Why did um, stop moving? Oh. Okay, I'll use Paul my lot. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I'll pull up my, my two-handed talon, the guy right in front of me, uh, below me. There you go. Oh, you want yeah. him to below you? Yep, let's yeah. do it. Alright. Uh, Click on your talon, boy. A nine is not gonna do it. You swing down at him and the goblin steps out of the way. You crash your sword against some barrels. Oh. Uh, this is not going well, you guys. No, it's not. No, <laughs> it was no, going no. better last week. We're all gonna die. Um, no, we're not. This we're is not the end. We can, we can stop this, okay? This is the end. All right, <laughs> not Carlisle, the end. you're up. It's been an honor playing with you boys oh, tonight. Yoshi you, didn't, Yoshi, you didn't want to move? Uh, oh, well, I, actually, I you move. can't because you would they provoke move, attack. They can all take, they can yeah. all take swings oh, at you. I'm, I'm trying to figure right. out who, who I want to help out more. I feel like the bear the bear, and Drothgar can handle the big bad evil guy. So I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to... <laughs> let me think. Uh, take my hand crossbow, which I'm pretty sure I reloaded already, um, and aim it at, directly at um, this guy here. All right, let's see it. Shoot your shot. Oh it my goodness. Slams into a barrel. <laughs> missing. Uh, well, do you want to move at all? Lovely. Uh, Why is this happening? No, I'm going to stay where I am. <laughs> Alright, the owlbear is... He can't get through that door. There's too much, so he's just going to wait. Oh, Crust, good. you're up. Oh, good. Um, <laughs> double fist. <laughs> so... The king guy is pretty low, right? King, king Grawl looks rough. Oh yeah, I'm a, I'm a, bite him. All right, let's see it. Um, a nine does not hit. What in the world is I'm happening? Gonna I'm gonna claw him then. <laughs> a twenty does hit. Go ahead and click the damage. Ooh, okay, crust, okay. crust. How do you want to do this? <laughs> Um, I want to put my claw up his nose and then just rip rip it off. <laughs> That's what the nose also gets like the brain with it. All right, so <laughs> you go to wow. you snap your jaws shut just as he moves back, and you see your opportunity. Your claw slams up into his both not nostrils, just, please. Yeah, into his two nostrils, but also like into his cheeks as well because your claw is so huge. You rip back, and his face comes off with his brain, and just. <laughs> And he just, the shell of, of Grawl crashes to the ground. 
Um, cool. <laughs> yeah, and, and then you, so you just like take it? Do you eat the head or do you just put it I down? I want to teabag the body. Oh, <laughs> you do so. As a um, bear. <laughs> we just as this, crush, crush, crush. <laughs> as just happens, um, Yoshi, you notice this goblin? Yeah. His eyes go wide. And he looks over to his friends and they start speaking in a language you don't understand. Like, just like yelling at each other, something. And then you hear one voice yell back here Growl is dead! Crawl is dead! And then you hear, Crawl is dead! <laughs> and they start screaming, all of them screaming, almost in, in chorus, Crawl is dead! Crawl is dead! And, um... And they look terrified. Uh... Snarl... Is going to move back here. And cower. Uh, okay, Virith. Hmm... Hmm. Hmm. That's, a big, uh, that's a big thonk. It is. Donks. She is going to disengage and run Pussy. over here. <laughs> Whoa. Um. Okay, run over there. Zathira, you're up. Do you give mm. chase? What do I want to do? See, I had planned my entire move around King Grawl not dying. And had so... no faith. No faith in the oh, bear sorry, claw. sorry, sorry. The bear clap, if you I'll will. never forgive you. If I move... If I move right here and Oops. cast burning hands... Would I be able to hit? Whoa! What was that? Yoshi? And not hit Yoshi? If you can step here? Yeah. You could cast on such an angle that you would hit these two. The you'd hit four of them and not hit Yoshi. Yeah. Okay, that's what I want to do. So I'm gonna move over here. Do you have right. any spells left? Uh, first levels. Okay. Awesome. I, I used all my second levels, but thankfully, Burning Hands is just a first level spell. Nice. So I'm gonna cast Burning Hands. Uh, at level one. Okay, their dex save. Ooh, four damage. That's rough. They did fail their dex save though, so they all take four damage. Yay! Um. Wow. Now, if I move away, does this guy get to hit me? Yes. <laughs> wow. I'm just stay here. Stay there. <laughs> I'm gonna just stay right here. <laughs> I'm gonna stay right here. All right. Oh, I have to update my, my sheets so that I know I use one of my spells. Alright. Um, the goblins are going to disengage. Yeah, run away. Just <laughs> their bonus action. To do? Well, I mean, all things considered, do we should we really let them run away? A lot of I mean, us aren't looking too good at yeah, the moment. I have 7 HP. Yeah, I mean, but we could... Ah, uh, yeah, I guess. And then, as far as we know, this thing isn't disin... Yeah, Maybe I can make as... friends with it. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it's hard to see as a fellow bear. Our, our biggest concern is <laughs> this Dark Elf. And the bug... I think she uh, almost the did. The and Owl she, bear. Uh, I feel like I could probably intimidate her. Into sleeping with you? No, just intimidate her to stop. <laughs> and maybe even be our friend, who knows. You will okay, be my friend. So the goblins just start sprinting away, like, in terror. Good, be afraid. They are. Good. Good. Um, okay. So the goblins are essentially, well, unless you guys chase them. Okay, Drothgar, you're up. Um... Um, um, Javelin the Dark Elf from the main room. <laughs> no, I'm trying to, like, <sighs> man. Craig, can I intimidate this thing? Intimidate what thing? You can try. This owl bear? You can certainly try. <laughs> I don't know what to connect here. Can I intimidate him from here? <laughs> <laughs> 
you can half your movement to get off of the bear. So that's 15 feet of your movement. You step down, you pull back the curtain. You want to, you want to intimidate him? Yeah, and... All right, and you do, like, what do you do to intimidate him? Let's hear it. Rawr. You go. <laughs> step off. <laughs> back, back up. Go back. Yeah. Where you were. <laughs> I'm just gonna yell, yo, step up. Okay, cool. Uh, go ahead and make an intimidation check. <laughs> That's gonna be your action, though, just so you know. Okay. That just throws the curtain back. Uh... It looks at you, its eyes <sighs> narrow, and it starts scratching at the ground like it's gonna charge you. Buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Move away, drop guard. Am I allowed to? Still you can move. Yeah, yeah, you still have ten feet of movement. You can't mount him because you don't have half your movement. But you can move back over here or something. Uh, okay, you I'll go here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Good. Good job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, was, that was a good move. G G. Yeah, G G. I tried. I tried, guys. <laughs> G G. Tried so hard. Yo, step off. <laughs> Opens the curtain. Back Yo, up. step off. Closes the curtain. <laughs> <laughs> Could you um, please step off? <laughs> Be gone, the Back thought. Up. All right. Uh, yeah, that doesn't work. Were. Yoshi, you're up. Yo. So you can see this drow woman coming around the corner, running. Shoot. Exactly. Yeah, I'll hit her with my longbow. All right, she's gonna have like half three quarters cover though, unless you want to move. Can I move up? Like, how far can I move up? You have thirty feet, so you can. You'd have to move through. Yeah, you could do that. Sick. All right, longbow time, man. All right, shoot her in the Wait face. Her face, yo. Yeah, there we go. Well, that missed. Oh, <laughs> yes. you, you like have yeah. right into your face, and you aim at the wall, and it clang clatters against the wall. <laughs> you guys can't hit for move. No, because um, I'm Yoshi. Yeah, she she like ha, nice try, and then kind of looks around. Um, Carlisle, you're up. I'm just seeing something really quick. Uh, I will move. Would if I move over here, would I be able to hit her with a say a chromatic orb? Yeah, for sure. If you have that much, yeah, you've got 25 feet. You can totally do that. Yep, so I'll, I'll do that. And then I whip out, I take out my di uh, this diamond that I have and yeet it at her face. Uh, uh, what what, what, what element do you What choose? element? Uh, I, sorry, I, I'm, I'm looking. I would All have it be, no, well, no, uh, acidic. Ooh, acid. So as you take the diamond, you throw it, and as you do it, this Aesthetic energy surrounds it, and it launches forward at her with magic propulsion. 16. Ooh. 16 does hit. And boom, it slams her in the chest, and she, like, falls backward a little bit. Her eyes go wide as this big acid burn is spreading up her chest and neck. Wait, did, that do, did that do 16 points of damage? Yep. Chromatic Orb is a really, 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 really good first level spell. <laughs> It's like one of the best. Yep. How is she not dead? She she hasn't been touched yet. That was the first yeah. damage you've done to her. Oh really? You missed yeah. all your attacks on her. I have been attacker. I've been attacking King Grawl. Nobody has hit her yet. Yeah. All right. Um. Oh, you missed them. You missed nice all shooting, the attacks. Nice shoot, Yeah, bud. Okay. It is the owl bear's turn. <laughs> the owl bear is going to squeak. Oh, he can't finish his sp turn in that space. The owlbear is going to come right up to here and, like, start squeezing through, angry, but, like, snarling and scratching at the wall, <laughs> trying to murder you. Boys, we got to deal with that come at some point. He's going to ready in action. Oi, oi, oi. Shut He's going to ready in action and then crust. It's your turn. <sighs> I'm a, I'm a, I'm a walk towards it. And okay. Fight. And claw it. So you can step here. You can't finish your turn here. You'll have to move back. So he'll he'll get a free swipe at you. But you can you can do this. I can I can walk. Well, I guess you're in the same amount of space here, so that's okay. No, you know what? You can do that. You can finish your sp turn okay. there. Twenty. Oh. 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 Wow. Yeah, <laughs> Thank you, baby. Yeah. 
Jeez, dude, 15 points. So you step around the corner and you just start snarling, you bite and claw at it. It it's recoils, surprised it. Whoo! That's you really aggressively. <laughs> 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 yeah, <"Ooh." laughs> just looking uh, very upset. Uh, snarl. Snarl is going to. Snarl is going to cower. Um, Alright, you guys are attacking it. She's going to run up towards you. And she's going to just take her fists and one big punch to each of you. Jeez. Alright, Yoshi, first attack is against you. That is a 16 to hit. 16, or let me check that actually hit. Yeah, that's a hit. All right, you take eight points of bludgeoning damage as she just what? Punch, she just punches you in the face. Guys, I'm dying. Are you at zero health? <laughs> I'm at seven. Oh. Okay. Oof. All right, and then she takes the second. He she takes the second step and swims right at you, Carlisle. Oh boy. As a oh a ten to hit, so she whiffs. Yep. Just, <laughs> as you manage to step back, just, hands raised, just like. Uh. <laughs> Okay, uh, that is her turn. Zathira. That's me. Man, um, we could really use a spellcaster right now. <laughs> You're gonna get one. Just chill, okay? <laughs> Fif so 15 feet, so that's... Okay, so if I move here, I can cast Burning Hands on her. And Yeah, but you will also hit Carlisle. Will I hit Carlisle? Yeah, it's you'll actually call. hit both your friends. Okay, well then... Well, I'm I guess if you aim it at the wall... You yeah, can aim it at the wall. That's true. Okay. I mean, like, it's not like my hero where you just, like, take your hand and funnel it on your other hand and it makes a straight line. It could yeah, very yeah. well. I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot the wall and just wreck her with it. Are you ready for this? Bank that fire off the wall. Okay, sounds yeah. good. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh my goodness. Rolling that damage. That is almost max damage. Um, yeah. Bish field deck saving throw. Ooh, rolled a natural twenty on the deck wow. save, so it's gonna be half half damage, but it still That's hurts. Still a lot of damage. Still eight points of damage. That's, That's a, a lot, lot of damage. damage. You guys, that That's is, a damage that is not a lot and of damage. fire damage. Um, <laughs> it's like you you see her like putting out the flames, and you hear her go ulam in like a in like this guttural language that none of you understands. Because zoom tight. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, also, the goblins. The goblins all here. run away. The goblins are all off the map now. Please Long ways away. Lives. They ran. Except for this one that's used for the. Initial oh, game. that's the. Well, okay. <laughs> Drothgar, you're up. Uh, can I javelin it? <laughs> I eat yeah, the javelin. Of <laughs> I kick I down the door. Crust, what do you want me to do? Do you want me to try and intimidate it, or do you want me to help you just, just kill the thing? Yo, step off! <laughs> Crest? Mr. Hez? You're cutting out a lot, David. Mr. Hez. Do it. Mr. Hez? Is it me? I think it's you. It's me, I, what? I can hear David. Oh, Mr. never Hez. mind. Hello? Do you, want me to, do you want me to kill it? Go for it. Javelin it right in its stupid owl beak. It's still looking right, pretty I'm healthy. Going to, I'm going to javelin this thing. No! <laughs> oh, you throw the javelin and it just sails wide. No purchase on anything. I'm sucking. And because you didn't take damage last turn and you didn't hit anybody with a melee attack, you lose your rage. Ooh. Okay, well, that's, you know, okay. I mean, you are no longer right. acceptable. Alright, do you want to move? Don't attack me. Uh, can I, can I, can I move right here? You can run further than that. You have 20 more yeah. feet of movement. Yeah, you have 30 feet total. I'll, I'll stay right here. Alright, backing up crust. I like that. Yeah. Yoshi, you're up. There's a person all up in your grill now. She just punched right. you in the nose. I'll just do a two-handed <laughs> talon to her all face. Right. 
14 wow. is just what you need to hit. Wow. Oh, baby, let's go. <laughs> you swing the longbow under your back and pull out your shiny new sword and carve across her. And as you do, you watch as, like, her arm, like, cuts open and you see her blood is, like, this weird black ooze. Ooh, it's not it's normal blood. blood. Mm. That, that's, that's drow for you. Actually, Carlisle, venom? Gar yeah. Car yeah. Carlisle, make a uh, make venom? a nature check for me. Make a nature check. Hold up. Nature Damn, nature, you scary. Yeah, that's drow for you. All right, Carlisle, you're up. Nice. I don't know Good how job. confident I feel after that one. Uh, <laughs> I will take out my um... longbow. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I will take out my short sword and try to cleave her uh, across the face. Let's see it. Go destroy her. Unfortunately, you, you try and get past her defense, but she actually just like grabs your sword and throws it back. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah, it's kind of <laughs> scary. I, this so this, when... this this is karma for you hitting your hitting her with an acid ball. I can do yep. that. Uh, do you want to move? You have cunning actions, so you can bonus uh, yeah, action. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna say I was gonna say bonus action disengage, and I can still move, right? Yeah, you still have thirty feet of movement. You haven't used any movement yet. I'm going to move yeah, over just here. Leave, leave just to get to a little bit of distance <laughs> between between us. <laughs> okay. Sorry, Yoshi. You... Okay, Yoshi's gonna die. <laughs> the owl bear is gonna start mauling you, Crust. I dare him to. Take one with its beak and one with its claws. That's a 23 to hit with the beak uh, and a 24 to hit with the claws. Uh, yeah. Okay, you take, after adding them together, you take a grand total of 20 points of damage. Oh. Wow. You have, you your, your bear form has one hit point left. Oh, Fun. Wow. Plenty. Oh my god. Yeah. That is hitting hard. If it hit me, I would have been dead. <laughs> it hit me for a 13 it, the it... second it walked through that door. <laughs> Crust, would you like to retaliate? Oh, I'm going to retaliate, all right. <laughs> oh I'm going to turn into a person and run away. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. Natural 20. Oh, boy. And a 13 is just what you need to hit. Both wow. those hit. And hit the other one. Oh, you did. 18? 18 points of damage. Suck it. Nice. You like <laughs> bite into it as it comes and hits you with its claw. You bite into its arm and pull out this chunk of flesh before slashing across its face with your claw. And it lets out a. <laughs> it's not happy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Snarl, Snarl is basically out of the fight. Snarl is cowering in a corner. Uh, Alright, it is Virith's turn. Steen Carlisle back away. Virith turns and says, Looks like you're, only thing in, you're the only thing in the way, my dear. And just starts beating you, oh. uh, Yoshi. Oh, She's just gonna no. start busting your face. Good job, Carlisle. Alright, that's a 24, 24 to wait, hit. Uh, wait, wow! I, I got hit. 24 hit, that's 7 points of bludgeoning damage. Oh, bro. I'm dead. You had 0 hit points? Zero. Okay, you're unconscious. You're not dead. Don't oh, worry. You, boy. What does has nobody, has do nobody dropped to 0 before? No. no. Ooh! Okay, no, we got I to do thought, new things. Thought, um, crusted. Crusted? Crust? No, yeah, I, 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 had, I have no. the iron skin or whatever it's called. No, oh, you man, have the a relentless endurance, I think it's called. Yeah, that's what it's called. Alright, so she just clocks you in the face. Do you guys watch as Yoshi just falls over in a heap of meatball? Oh, wow. And, just yeah. and then she runs. And she runs through the door. Oh, no. Zathira, you're up. Where did, she, where did she run? She ran through this door. Oh, what a bitch. Zathira, you're up. Uh, all that's left is the owl bear. Can I open the door? Yeah, you you Wait. kick open the door. <laughs> I oh kicked no! Down the door with all the goblins. Who? Okay. The goblins Who? ran away. But what if they're hiding I right can't, there? I can't see behind the door. In your own I know. I'm, I'm revealing. Give me a sec. Who has the healing potions again? Oh. 
I think ever. Yeah. Oh. Um, if you have a right. healing potion, if you have a healing potion, you can use your action to shove it down Yoshi's gullet. Um, you see her. She she's over. She's right there. I don't. Um, did you just I'm see her? wondering if if burning hands would hit her because it's fifty. Not from feet. here. No, because it's fifty feet from you. You got to um, start on yourself. I got to go. Oh. Yeah. Um. Well, I, I think think you, do, you, do you still how's, have enough? How's she looking health wise? She's looking bloody, dude. Like she looks oh, like okay. she's been beat. That means like a little. That means if, if somebody's bloodied, it means they're below half. She's yeah, looking. Um, she's looking beat up. Would you yeah, have I'm enough gonna, movement? I'm gonna cast a fireball at her then. Fireball. Okay. No, she. she uh, Zathira has no more movement. She's all thirty feet. Okay. Okay. No, I use twenty five to get here. Oh, then you can move forward. And I was gonna answer. say, yeah. Yeah, I could, but my my issue is like, do I really want to move here, cast burning hands, not be able to run back, and then her beat me to death because I also only have 7 HP <laughs> we are um, not looking good here but Fireball. you know what fine YOLO fine, okay. fine. YOLO I love it <laughs> burning hands you better hit good natural 1 alright 14 let's see if she she uses her dex better she rolled a 9 she takes all 14 points nice. of damage she she screams in pain as her clothes all light on fire, and you watch as like 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 patches of her flesh start like exploding out as like the pressure is just building up under her skin. Can I also roll a nature check to see if it's yep that's yeah. brow? <laughs> yeah, make it make a nature check. Um, uh, blah, 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 blah. character sheet core. Where is my nature? It's in uh, skills. Wow. Whoa. Oh, yeah, okay, so you're like, now wait a second. Everything kind of slows down. You have a Jimmy Neutron brain blast. <laughs> um, so, drow, people don't like drow. Drow, generally, they live in the Underdark. They're they're evil creatures, like, just by nature. They worship Loth, who's like an evil spider goddess. Is, it, is this drow from Menzo Barazin? Yeah, yeah, drow, drow are, yeah, Menzo Barazin, that's in Faerun. You've been reading D and D books, haven't you? Um, <laughs> drow, like drow, are not people. Don't like drow, but drow are still like like they're people. Like they bleed red. Like they're like this. Whatever this is, this is not a drow. Hmm. But it looks like a drow. It is, sounds like a drow, but this but is not a not drow. drow. Make fun of its god. Be like, hey, yo, what are you? Black, You're not a god. drow. Drow don't bleed black. Um, Do you bleed? <laughs> um, that is the end of your turn. I can't talk? You can talk. She just t looks over her shoulder at you, snarling, also screaming in pain because she's on fire. <laughs> um, Burn, you satanic being! Um, okay. <laughs> At the start, uh, it is now the start of the round. Drothgar, it's your turn. All right, I got a javelin. This this boy. You're gonna try. I'm gonna try. I've been rolling like shite. You the whole will night. try. Fifteen hits. You rear back and you you hear the the satisfying thunk of a of javelin hitting flesh as it sinks in. <laughs> he just. It lets out a hoo. <laughs> can I can I intimidate while on the same roll? <laughs> you can you can try to intimidate it. It, it probably won't do anything because it'll take your action to really intimidate it. But even though like 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 yo step off. How, I get one action completely right in this. Yeah, attack, which was the attack? Action. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'll go back here. Okay. <laughs> okay. So just uh, because we're on Yoshi's turn now. So this oh, is what happened. Well, <laughs> this, is, this, is how, um, this is how unconsciousness works. So when you hit zero hit points, you can't go below zero. There's no negative hit points, okay? So if, you, right. if you're if you at one hit point and you get hit by 20, uh, you, you go to zero. There's not negative 19. Right. When you're at zero, you're considered unconscious. When you're unconscious, you make what's called a death saving throw. Oh. You roll a d20. If it's a 10 or higher, you succeeded. If it's a 9 or below, you failed. Oh, if you shoot. fail, if you fail three of them, you die. If you succeed oh. on, if you succeed on three of them, you um, you you remain unconscious, but you're stable. So you 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 aren't dying anymore. 
Uh, if you roll a natural 20, you immediately wake up with one hit point. If you roll a natural one, you immediately fail two death saving throws. Jeez. <laughs> no pressure. Now, now death, wait. Man. Now there's a couple things that can happen. If anybody heals you, you immediately get back up. Your your death saving throws reset. Okay. What if anybody heals, you? like regardless of his rolls. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, he doesn't have to roll. If somebody heals you, you're back in the game. But he um, doesn't have any healing spells. I don't have yeah. any. I don't have a. We we got potions though. Don't we have any potions left over? I don't have a potion. I don't no, have a potion. They... Both if it's not written in your inventory, you don't have it, so make sure you're writing things down. Um, the other thing is, if somebody wants to make a medicine check on him, you can do that to immediately stabilize him. So he doesn't have to make any more saving throws, but you have to succeed, and depending on how he took the damage, it might be harder. So he just got punched in the face, so it probably wouldn't too, be too hard to stabilize him. But he's beat up. He's been attacked by some goblins, so he's not in a super comfortable place. So you can, you can try to stabilize. Actually, with a medicine check, you can try to stabilize. Oh, no, no. It's hard to do unless you have a medicine kit, which I don't think any of you are proficient in medicine. No. no. So so it would be very difficult for you to, to stabilize him with a medicine kit, or with a medicine check, but you can try. So those are options, but for now, Yoshi, at the top middle of your page, you should see something that says death saves. Oh, like uh, like my character sheet? Yeah, on your character sheet, uh, right next to where it says hit dice, above your weapons. Oh, yeah. Go ahead and click, just click death staves. Alright, so that's one success. So, Yoshi, you can mark off one, one of the successes. You see how there's the bubbles? Oh, yeah. Just click one and success. There you go. All right, look at Yoshi. He probably won't <laughs> die. All right, probably won't die. Car Carlisle, you're up. I will uh, oh, run over here. Uh, would I be able to yeet my? Cr well, it's ninety feet, but would I be able to yeet it past? Uh, oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I, I take just out my. Yeet the crossbow as a I, whole. I don't need to run and grab my <laughs> diamond. It just magically appears in my pocket again, right? The oh the the chromatic the diamond yeah yeah it does okay. Uh, so yeah, I, I will, I will take my chromatic cord and throw it at the, at, uh, how many first level spell slots do you get? Two, I believe. Nice. I That's get... pretty cool. Yeah. Where is it? Go for it. it. Yeah. Yeet it, boy. Oh! Oh! oh. oh. Uh, and that, I, I will make no, it, I will make, damage? I will make it thunder damage. And how would you want to, How do you want to do this? Yeah! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I take it. I take it, and I hit her with it, kind of, kind of like I mark her, and then I just kind of look at her, snap my fingers, and thun and thunder damage. Yeah. So, so the the diamond flies just over your shoulders, Athera, and it slams. Did I flick it with my tail at her too. Did you get yeah, you like spank it. Yeah, and it, it arcs around <laughs> and it slaps her. It slaps her like in the in the shoulder and the chest. And there's just like this little like glow left on her shoulder. And she looks down as the diamond winks out of dis uh, winks away. And we see Carlisle, and he it apparates in his one hand, and he snaps his fingers, and you watch as her whole shoulder and like chest just explode with thunder damage, and she, boom, falls into little pieces. Um, but her body, like her face and the rest of her body, is mostly intact still. And Zathira, as she crumples to the floor, you see something weird, and you'll have to like. <laughs> You know, do do your own. You know, you'll have to um, not metagame too hard when you see what this thing is called. But you see, it turns into what looks like this. Ooh, ooh, very wow. nice, very nice. Where's its genitals? <laughs> Show me your genitals. Your genitals. I can, it's androgynous. I can say that because that's a character trait of mine. Uh, it's androgynous. Did More than Carlo, androgynous. It's did Carlisle Thanos snap that thing to... <laughs> Thanos snapped it he out of like existence. Thanos snapped it. Yeah. You just All say, right. I just take the diamond, I whisper, Thank you, Zenya. Oh, <laughs> I am inevitable. <laughs> um, Alright. We cut back over to the owl bear, the, the bear battle that's happening in this doorway. The owl bear is going to yeah, go in on you. The owl bear is going to bite at you, Crust. Do it. 
He won. Nat natural <laughs> one. He wow! He to snap at you, and it snaps into the wall instead, like just a giant chunk of it. So it pulls back with its claw and goes to stab you in the face. Natural one. Rolls a nine. And no, listen, sir. the second roll was a natural 20. That would have done, I kid you not... 23 points of damage. Oh my gosh! <laughs> yeah, it was natural funny, but it was a 9. So it slams with its claw just into the ground in front of you. You barely dodge it. You feel you feel like a chill of the wind as it barely misses you. Crust. Barely misses you. Oh, Crust, oh it is your turn. You already know, I'm a biting claw. I do already know. That hits, yes. and that yes. hits. Let's see it. Seven and nine. Oof. Sixteen points of damage. You tear into this thing's like arm as it misses. It leaves like an exposed limb, and you just start ravaging it. It. This thing is looking rough. Like it falls over on that. Le like it can't stand on that leg anymore. It's looking up at you. Ooh. 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 <laughs> it is. It, it, it now. It can barely stand. <laughs> barely. Um, <laughs> barely. Zathira. Uh, You're up. You see your friend dying on the ground in front of you. Yeah, that's not important. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> wow. So, you said I can use a, a medicine check to try and save him? You can try. Yeah, it would be very, very difficult because you don't have a medicine kit. Oh, okay. Um, is there any way I can help him at all? Or like... <laughs> <laughs> if you so, have a healing potion. Okay, let me be here. Yoshi, I mean, Yoshi. Can I, I, mean, can I yeah. force feed him a dong? <laughs> that is awful in so many ways. <laughs> wow. I have some perfume. That's like necrophilia. I kind have of. some perfume. <laughs> Spray it with perfume. <laughs> At least you'll smell good when you die. <laughs> Let me just check really quick. I want to make sure I'm not lying to you guys. I have to remember where, um... What, in the PHB? Yeah, I'm just trying to see... Oh. Okay, you can use an action to administer first aid to an unconscious creature and attempt to stabilize it with a medicine check. Oh, it's only DC 10. So it's actually not that hard to stabilize him. Okay. You, you just have to be able to make the check. So you have to roll a medicine check and get higher than 10. Okay, and that counts as my action, or...? Yes, that's your action. Do I have to be beside him? Yep. Okay, well... You have to I'm bend moving. down and basically give him first aid. I'll, ooh, I'll bend down for him, all right. Don't worry. <laughs> yes. I'm bending for you. You yeah, can't get that right view. For an action. Yeah. Can I get that uh, view action? First medicine... There it is. Hey! There we go. All right, so Yoshi, you're still unconscious, but you're not dying anymore. Yoshi, go ahead and roll 1d4 for me. What, how do you do that? Slash R space 1D4. Okay, so you will be unconscious for two hours before you wake up, unless you get Jeez. healing. Wow. Okay. Alright. So I guess you're gonna drink my body everywhere, guys. <laughs> That's okay. We've got we've got a few people, not me, who can do it. <laughs> Yeah, Drothgar can carry you. <laughs> All right, Drothgar. Well, just You're let up. me take care of this freaking owl bear first. <laughs> we just hear past the door. So, ooh, do you want ooh, to befriend like, this? This who? This this uh, owl's like suffering pretty bad, eh? Yeah. Well, I just want to gaze straight into its eyes and go. Hoo -hoo. F you! And then... <laughs> <laughs> what? Throw a, a jab on that. <laughs> F you! Oh, oh, wow. oh. There you go. And it sinks into its neck and it goes, Ooh, and it just dies. You watch it die. Phew. <laughs> and guys, you survived. Oh my <laughs> gosh! <laughs> Just barely. barely. <laughs> drag me, guys. Drag me. Uh, so we're out of combat. You guys are now uh, out of combat. Is doppelganger still here? Can I search it? Yeah, you can search the body for sure. Okay, I want to search the body. Yo, my what kill. No, I'm already here. 
is this a campfire? <laughs> there is a fire in there. It's like a brazier that's lit. That we're allowed to rest there, right? You can rest wherever you want. Oh, this isn't Dark Souls. You don't need a campfire to rest. I would like to turn back to myself, please. Okay, you turn back into you, and you, you're at full health. Like, you took no damage. <laughs> I want to go into... That's hold insane. on. Uh, I want to go into this this room and cast Let's Speak with Animals on the wolf. Oh, okay. No. You go into the room, you cast Speak with Animals. You have, a, you have a spell slot left to cast it? Yeah, I have two. Okay, you cast speak with him. Ah. You now speak wolf. Hey, yo, ma. <laughs> <laughs> um, basically, I just want to ask him if uh, if he's like a threat still, or if he's just going to be chilling there. He looks, he says, I... You speak wolf? Yes. <laughs> it's, it's pretty impressive. Um... No, I'm just gonna chill if that's cool. <laughs> do you wanna do you wanna be my pet? I I'm nobody's pet. Never and li again. And, li and limited dongs for the rest of your life. I don't meet. What is what is that? Um, I'll be right back. <laughs> I need a dong, please. Just <laughs> <laughs> goes barreling around the corner. Just teleports. Um, how many do I have? <laughs> I have one dong and four ears. Would you like one dong and two ears? I'll take a dong and an ear. Just one ear or two ears? I'll just go for the one. Okay, you can have one dong and one ear. Thank you. <laughs> this is a dong. <laughs> I, give him, I give him the dong. Oh, you mean like a literal penis? Okay. Yeah, yeah it's a dong. He, uh, he eats it. He says... Gonna be honest, it's not quite as good as a, a rabbit or anything like that. Can I make him throw it up? <laughs> he doesn't deserve the dong if he's not gonna be mine. <laughs> he doesn't. You, you want to like pin him down and try to force him? To <laughs> him? I make. I make remove. Yes. No, he like dog. backs away from you. Like he's like, no. What are you doing? No. I. I'm leaving. This is I... enough. Of this and he just he runs away. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Wow. So what does would... what does this doppelganger have on him? Um, while you're looking at the doppelganger, so you realize the doppelganger, it, it, the clothes even that it was wearing are not real. Like it's 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 all part of its kit. And um, does it have a penis? It does not. Dang uh, it! For you to remove, there is nothing on this thing's body. Okay, I would like to head? search King yeah. Brawl's body, please. I'm cutting yeah. his head off. I'm so. Searching. Okay, so as you cut off the head of the doppelganger, uh, Crest, you're in here searching this room. Crest, you found a lot in this room. Oh, mm. sick. You're, you're so lucky. That Bring you, me my money. You found uh, a stitched leather sack containing uh, 220 silver. Oh, he's going to take it all. <laughs> Two, and 80 gold. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Also... <laughs> Also, three potions of healing. Oh, okay. Okay. And what looks to be a map to a cave. Map Ooh. to cave. Cool. I like and it. As, and as you're looking through this, and at the top of the map it says, Entrance to Wave Echo Cave. Cool. Cool. And also you realize that there is an unconscious dwarf in the room. <laughs> That's not the... I, I, but do, you all, do you guys all just leave Yoshi? Well, I mean, we can't really do anything with him until we um, leave. Can I carry him into here with me? Because I sure. want to search this room. Okay, so we'll get back to you guys in here. Uh, I oh, want to talk. I can just heal him. What? Yeah. 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 <laughs> so I was trying to make friends with the wolf first, but yeah, I'll just go heal him. Okay. You yeah, throw throw one Yoshi second. You me? run over here and you heal Yoshi. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll use my last spell slot on him. What are you going to cast? Cure Wounds? Oh, thanks. Bro. Uh, yeah. Oh, no, I have Healing Word right now. Okay. Go ahead. He'll just, like, if we chill okay. here for a couple hours, he'll... Yoshi, you have four health, but you are awake. Oh, shoot. Hey, buddy. You wake up to Dr Drothgar's dreamy eyes. Yoshi? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Yoshi. <laughs> I'm um, searching this stuff. Whatever. Yeah, when you look in here, this looks like it was like a shrine. 
There's a stone altar in the middle of this room covered with blood-stained black cloth. There are golden ritual implements like a chalice, a knife, and a censer carefully arranged on the altar. Um, you look over it, and you kind of, like, nod slowly. This stuff, and you weren't here for this crust. Uh, Drothgar got here first. Uh, this stuff is worth <laughs> a pretty petty. Um, the, ch the chalice, you figure, is worth probably about 150 gold. Ooh. Okay. Uh, the knife, the ceremonial, like, looking knife, is probably worth about 60 gold. And it can also function as a dagger. Okay. And there's all these, like, human-made art objects um, that are probably worth about 120 gold. Okay. Wow, that's a lot. Um, also, Jothgar, I have a gift for you. Um, <laughs> um, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm taking it. I'm taking it all. Yeah. <laughs> and okay. then I want to talk to Crust privately. Yep. Oh, me too. I've come here. Wow. Hey, Go make so, out in the uh, corner. What's going on? <laughs> so, uh, uh, you know. Wait, I have a gift for you before we talk. Okay. And I give you three potions of healing. <gasps> oh, <gosh. laughs> all, all three? Yep. Oh my gosh. Wait, I buy what did his you say love. anything? I buy his love. No, you want to buy his loot. <laughs> no, no, I just happened to give him the three potions of healing. Um, For free. Make sure you write those down, Drothgar. I, I, yeah, it's in my thing. And I want to, uh, I really appreciate the help, Crest. You know, you and I have been have been blood brothers for quite some time here, and uh, you know, we like to get down and dirty. We do like to get down and dirty, and kill, yes, and kill stuff. You know, and yeah. I remember that one night that we had in that motel as well. The cuddles were oh, amazing, wow. yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So I, I have a dagger and some art. It comes to a cumulative total of 180 gold. Wow. And uh, I would like to... I would like to... <laughs> possibly. To I'd like to give it to you. Yeah. Stop, you don't have to. <laughs> but, but I want to. <laughs> I give him a hug. I give him a big old hug. Crust is gonna be Touch rich. The dog. <laughs> You guys are going to be walking down the road in like a couple weeks and you just hear clank, clank, clank coming from his coin purse. It's just overflowing. So how much is the decorative dagger worth? The dagger is about 60. 60 gold. Okay. And uh, the art that I picked up is about 120 gold. Oh my goodness. Don't just add it to your gold. I'm not. No, I'm not. Yeah. Okay, good. How do I I'm get rid of it. like, how do I get rid of like items that are now empty. Like, I, I oh. entered them in, but now there's, oh, like, a box. there's a little lock at the bottom. If you click that, then little trash cans will appear, and you can oh, delete cool. things. I'm saving up for a really cool spear one day. That's my only goal in this game. So while you guys are <laughs> while you guys are over here talking, uh, Yoshi, you're kind of, like, coming to, blinking awake. We're going to go over to the other <laughs> side of the building. Um, <laughs> Zathira and Carlisle, you are in here with a passed out dwarf that you recognize as Gundren Rockseeker. Yeah, that's that's great and all. Can I see what's behind this door? Oh my. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Gundren, my friend, I'm sorry nobody else cares about you, there's but I do. How are you doing? Bug bear. <laughs> yeah, there's four another bug bears. <laughs> cracks your head open. Uh, Gun yeah, Gundren's unconscious okay. but lying there on the ground. Okay, um, let's 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 wake up Gundren. Can I slap him across the wow. face with oh a dong? No. <laughs> with a dong? With no. a dong. Um, oh, do we have no. like smelling salts, or can we just like tap his cheek? Smelling salts. Uh, you can you can. Yeah, let me get my smelling salts. Spray, salt. spray yeah, him with gonna, your perfume. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna jump up and down so my cheeks clap, and hopefully that'll just wake him up. <laughs> uh, yeah, Car Carlisle, you want to like pat his face yeah, or whatever I was gonna say, too. Yeah, just like a little like gentle like. <laughs> Hey, bud. hey, buddy. Hey, <laughs> buddy. Time to wake up, buddy. It's late. You're late he, for school. He kind of blinks slowly, and as his eyes open up, he looks and he says, "Oh, I've never had a pain in my head like this." And what? Uh, what happened? Do you remember it? Uh, what happened? Like, Carlisle. Hey, how's it going, buddy? What, what are you doing here? You're supposed to be. Hey, where are those goblins? And he like jumps up on his feet and starts swinging his fists around. 
<laughs> don't worry, don't worry, buddy. We 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 got but them. They're all There's dead, no, They're all they're all dead. They're all the, even it's the all owl bear. Now. Even the owl bear is gone. Oh my goodness. We handled it. Oh, thank you so much. And he gives you like a big hug. Yeah, it's no. Pro I, so I I'm like I I just like looking around this like lightly tap mm. on head. It's okay, buddy. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Prisoners of these goblins for almost a week now, and it's. Oh, it's starting to drive me crazy. Oh my! Well, we also oh. have—I uh, don't know if you remember them—but we also have uh, uh, the boys. Mr. Hez, Yoshi, and uh, Drothgar here as well. Oh, you oh, all made it! it. Yes, I we all made it. You're not, you there, you're not there yet, Mr. Hez. You're not there yet, Drothgar. This is all happening while you were talking to. to you can't be Crest. everywhere at oh. once. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna, I knock on the door. Hello. No. Oh, he the one time you knock on the door. <laughs> <laughs> um, he. What, what do I teleport back? Because you're not there you're not yet. Here. I, was I can't. Over. Are you? Are you thirsty, no, Gundren? Did you need this something? This is happening. Okay, I have to explain this to David. This was happening <laughs> as we were talking to Crust. This is all happening. Oh, at I'm the same ignoring time. Crust for now. So. I'm not. I'm not talking or anything. Yeah. So. Not trying to interrupt the conversation. <laughs> Bamf, um, he's with he kinda, Bamf, he's with Drothgar. Bamf, he's back at the door. <laughs> Teleports behind you, nothing personnel, kid. Um, <laughs> Gondrin, are you are you thirsty? You parched, my friend, or do you? Uh, so I could go for I could go for a drink. Yeah, I have, do you have a, any whiskey. I don't have any whiskey, but I do have water, and I pull out my water skin and uh, I, like hold it out to him. He kind of frowns for a second. Says, "That'll do." And then he takes he takes a, a bit of a drink. He says, "Oh, ah, my map! I can't leave without my map." What? Uh, he looks what? around the room. Jeez. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my <laughs> goodness! This is past my like rest of the <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing laps over it's here. It's triggered, <laughs> David. <laughs> I can't leave without me. I can't leave without my map. The map to Wave Echo Cave. Where, the whole where, reason we're together. What, where where uh, was the last place you saw it? That darn <laughs> Grawl took it from me. I don't know where he hid it. <laughs> maybe maybe it was on his body. Maybe it, maybe it was on his body. <laughs> maybe it was. And about now, now, Drothgar, now you guys can appear over here. <laughs> I don't want to go there. I want to look at this room down. <laughs> okay, Drothgar oh, walks through the door. Drothgar, you can you step on in. No, you know what? I don't want to. I don't want to step on in there. I want to go with Drothgar. <laughs> <laughs> what a baby! All right. Um, this he kind is... of looks at me and says, "It's it's it's possible. Let's let's take a look, shall we?" Yes, let's. And he goes, just... So when they're looking pointlessly, <laughs> um, may I inspect this room down here? Sure. You kick open the door. Cool. And. Oh. You see, the upper floors of this tower have collapsed to create a hollow silo at least 30 feet high. The upper reaches of the room are lost in shadows. Dust, rubble, and broken glass covers the floor, and old work tables and bookshelves lie strewn to the south. Uh, no. You can see where the owl bear was chained up to the wall. Mm. Um, but, yeah. Is there anything of value in here? Um, and make a check of some sort. It looks like there's a jagged ledge on the second floor. Go ahead and make a, a perception check for me. Uh, perception. Oops. The uh, eighteen will do it. Um, you see on that ledge, there's a there's like a um. A a chest. Dolf, oh, Drakkar, give me a boost. <laughs> okay, okay. So you, you, you lift him, you, you boost him up, and yeah, the chest looks like it's unlocked. Uh, what do I find in it? You find... Oh uh, my goodness, more money, let's go. 170 gold pieces. <laughs> uh, I'll drop like 20 down to drop. Right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, there looks to be a, there, and, and then there looks to be two like magical scrolls in here. Oh. When you open them up, one is a scroll of silence, which lets you cast a like cast a, a 
a, basically a big cube of pure silence, no sound, which makes it impossible for spellcasters to cast spells that need verbal components. And a scroll of the spell Revivify, which is a spell that you, looking over the spell, it seems very powerful. It almost looks like this could revive somebody who has died, but only within like a, the first minute of their death. Mm. It's okay. like a super magical defibrillator. Is that it? Yep. Is that, right. <laughs> Is that so, it? <laughs> here's my game plan. I'm a, I'm a waltz in this door with a little swagger in my step. I'm feeling big, you know? Yeah. And then <laughs> I throw this, the, the revive scroll to Zephyra. And I throw the the stealth one, the Carlisle, the the silence one, the Carlisle, and then I slap the map on the ground and I go, "Look what I found, boys!" <laughs> <laughs> and Gunter goes, "Ah, it's my map!" Uh, <laughs> Gunter, grab, grab it now! Grab it now! So I have essentially a scroll of revive. Yeah, yeah, it's called revivify. I was gonna keep it, but I figured I'm always in like some sort of animal form now. So he kind of he looks at it and goes, he, he goes. Uh, no, no cross. That's my map. My map, your map. You know, <laughs> whatever. It's it's a map. Which would you mind if I? Would you mind if I took my map? Yeah, you can have it. Gundren, does it does it have your name stamped on it? Please tell me it does. It does. On the back, it says Gundren Rock Seeker. See it right there. Well, uh, no. If you look closely, you'll see I scratched it out and wrote mine underneath, <laughs> Mister. <Yes. laughs> he looks at you and he says, "Ah, Chris, this is why I liked you." And he gives you a slap on the butt. Oh, I, I blush. <laughs> <laughs> he sports as you. Um, he says, uh, "All right, well, I've got me map. I've got me, uh, got me friends. Got me life. What do you say? I, I passed out in that corner for about eight hours." <laughs> What? I think we can all pass out for about eight hours there. Yes, that's that's wonderful. Eight eight he walks hours. over to this bed in the corner and just passes out. <laughs> I'm going to this bed right here. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk over here. I'm gonna so, go uh, to this bed so, too. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> and pass well, out. no, you, you can say your thing as everybody's leaving. It's no, okay. I was gonna say so. So cl clearly, everybody's been searching yeah. around, find anything good. Uh, nope. Just the scrolls, really. Just the yeah. scrolls. Yeah. Definitely not, uh, you know, thousands of gold pieces, you know, items equivalent to many monies. Can I tell? Yeah, if, no. Uh, no. Can I tell if they're lying? <laughs> <laughs> only you, you. I will only allow you to make an insight check if you can give me uh, a reason why you would think Crust is lying. I know. I I can't think of one. I I'm just. Uh, <laughs> I know. Because no, Crust no. Colin's lies. the worst kind of player. Don't worry. The, no, there there are I'm two. There being... are, there are two groups of players in the world, and both of them are in this game. <laughs> it's true. And I am being consistent to my criminal background. Uh, yes, there he is. Yeah, <laughs> I'm true. doing what my character would do. Yeah. <laughs> and right. uh, and with all all the all the beds taken up, I'll just sit at this table and lay my head on top. There's of a dog bed, bed still. Actually, you know, like, yeah, a, isn't Gundren on the dog bed? Isn't yeah, there that... is a dog bed. Where? Me and... uh, it's not on the map, but there's where Snarl used to sleep. Oh, okay. <laughs> Does the cat want to go in the dog the bed? Dog I was gonna bed. make the joke, but I didn't know if I. And yeah, sure. I'll sleep. I'll sleep in the dog's bed. All right. <laughs> so is this a long rest then? We're all fully healed, and you guys can all take a long rest. All your spells come back. All your your health is back. Oh, sir. shape shift back. <sighs> your rages yeah. all come back, David. Don't forget to mark that spell. Let's go. I keep forgetting that I have the ability. Um, what's it? What's it called again? Here, uh, font of magic, where I can turn sorcery points into spells. Yeah, and you can use your meta magics now. Your meta twin magic. spell. Remember oh, your yeah. twin spell and stuff. Except right. these the washing. I'll be right back. Okay. We just leave Yoshi behind in the castle. You guys. <laughs> You guys spend some time sleeping, stretching, feel much better as you all awaken the next morning. A um, little bit of a uh, spring in your step. So, and, uh, yeah. question. Mm -hmm. With my meta magic, empowered spell, 
it says I can spend one sorcery point to reroll a number of the damage dice up, up to my charisma modifier. Um, can I roll the spell and then just be like, oh, I don't like that, and then reroll it? Or correct. Okay. Yep. So I don't. I don't have to decide. No. It no, you don't have to say I'm empowering. Yeah. No. No. You, it's exactly what you said. Okay. Man, I feel so I'm empowered. A strong, independent woman. <laughs> I'm a yeah. strong, independent woman. Dragonborn. Okay. Okay. Cool. 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 So you guys all wake up the next morning. You feel much better. Crust your yeah. your coin purse feels much heavier. It's feeling very nice. Yes. Excuse me. <laughs> Can I want to keep my coin purse in my waterproof satchel that I found? Okay. Cool. How much money do you have? Huh? <laughs> Huh? We don't talk huh? about that. See, yeah, I can see how much money he has. I'm going to look. Is it impressive? <laughs> that is a... Uh, it's a hefty sum, not going to lie. Am I far ahead of everyone else? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sure, man. I, I'm pretty sure I have the second most. And that's 296. Uh, Yoshi is pretty close. To use a Thera Drothgar, you're sitting. I just want to see who has the least amount of gold. I think I know. Yeah, I think yep. I know too. It is Carlisle. He has three. Gonna shame him. <laughs> <laughs> How does Yoshi have more gold than me? Yoshi. Uh, he's found some gold. It's because. No, dude, you always just throw people money when you get it. Who, me? What? No, uh, Drothgar. Oh. Yeah. I don't throw people money. Okay, you did, um, Hannah. If, if that's the case, I'm going to come over here. Can I look behind this door? Sure, in the morning, you kind of wake up, and you're like, oh, yeah. I'll go take a look. Sure. Oh, I'm going to explore the castle. Does everyone want to come with me? You find. Sure. What? I'm all the way in the other room. I'm actually two rooms you away. What's happening? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to chase him down? I'll let yeah, you hear right, that. I'll, Don't worry, I'll, it's fine. I'll, I'll, tra I'll chase him down. Hold on. All right. Oh, so I, the three okay. of you are going to go into this room. Um, you open it up, and Zathira. It doesn't take you long to figure out. Um, this looks like some kind of um, <clears throat> some kind of kitchen. Uh, why, why doesn't it take me long to figure that out? Is because it looks I'm more like German. a it looks more like a banquet hall. I'm just going to ignore that. I'm, it looks more <laughs> like a banquet hall. Uh, with a soaring ceiling, 25 feet high, um, two large wooden tables, plain benches. Um, yeah, it looks looks pretty nice. <laughs> is is there anything worth like a perception check? Like, should I check to see if there's anything super awesome in here? Uh, it looks like if you continue through here, there's a there's a r another room. But other than that, well nothing. then, you know where I'm going. I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna stay behind and let the traps get you. <laughs> May I look what's in this room up here? Sure, I'm just gonna finish with these guys first. Okay. Yeah, you shut um, up their crust. In this room, it looks like there's some beds. Uh, no, that's about it. Uh, no perception <laughs> check is gonna change hey, that. Era. Nope. Hey, Zephira, you see those beds over there? Don't you start Drothgar. I walk over to the door overhearing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Don't open that. Wait, where did you, uh, Crest? How did you get there? He just uh, teleported wait. there. Like if you, if no, you... actually, I I used the walking thing. Yeah, I did see it. You went through this way. You went like that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you're gonna. Do you want to open up that door, Carlisle? Well, yeah, sure. Sure. You open up the door. Um. You see the following. Consider the following. Death. Dibs. Death. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. After he opens that door, I want to open this door. That uh, doesn't even matter. Oh, doesn't matter. Um, when do I get to open my door? I'll get to you in a second. Okay, so Carlisle, as you step door there... One. Um, you take a step... Wait... Uh oh. Hmm. The anti trap trigger, trigger has triggered big. the trap. <laughs> yeah, you you step through the door, and the only time you didn't check for a trap, you feel a little 
think on your ankle. <laughs> and you look up as a bunch of rubble just falls from the ceiling down at you. Oh, Go ahead and make a dexterity saving throw. <laughs> Ooh, oh, yeah! yeah. You take, so you, you step forward, you hear the tink, you look up, you take one step back, and it all boom, slams onto the ground in front of you. Uh, you take no damage. Just out of curiosity, Ooh. how much damage would he have taken? Uh, he would have taken... 10. Not very much. I rolled not, pretty bad. Not very much. It still would have put me close to half. Yeah. So you kind of just, whoa, step back, and uh, that happened. And I'm just like, right, my job. <laughs> <laughs> um, but in this room, it just looks like the opening. I am uh, back. Cr welcome back. Crest, uh, you want to open that door? Watch, the, uh, the door that Crest goes to has all the big good Not there. just open, I want to kick it down. You <laughs> kick open the door. Please be trapped, uh -oh. please be trapped, please be trapped. <laughs> you see the following room. Uh, it looks like old casks of salted meat and sacks of rotting grain fill this area. Among the supplies, you see a bloody suit of chainmail, a heavy crossbow, and an unsheathed longsword with the emblem of Neverwinter worked onto its hilt. <gasps> Is that, like, beneficial to any of the people? Um, you, you look at it for a second, um... You recognize? Do, do you look at the gear, or do you just kind of take it as gear? No, I, I I look over it. Yeah, it doesn't take you very long looking over it. Where in like the like in like the where the waistband of the armor would be, be there's a little tag, and it says property of Sildar Hallwinter. Ooh, Sildar. Oh. Well, so it, I, it doesn't well, take you long to uh to realize like. This is his gear. Like this is the gear that they took from him when they captured him. Um, I'll I'll pick it up. I'm gonna return it to him because I'm a nice guy. Cool. Or sell I'm it. Who knows? Sell it. <laughs> sell it. Yeah. Also, I'm going to sell it the room, to Silver. And the, the long sword you figure as well is probably. Yeah. Is. Bring um, him back to him and ask him for money for it. Yeah. <laughs> so how much is this worth to you? <laughs> you also notice because of your background, I'll let you have this. Um, Thank you. There's a small cask that you recognize the symbol on it. It is a very nice dwarven brandy. Oh, I pick it up. Yep. It's so, you, so you've got a cask of brandy and a suit of chainmail and a sword over your shoulder. Um, Beautiful. May I inspect this one, this door? Sure, Carlisle. I know you're. I know you're moving too. Uh, you, you you probably came through this door at the same time. We both yeah, we we both. Uh, but first, for, for I check for traps. <laughs> oh, you do? Okay, make an investigation check. Because <laughs> I've learned. Yeah, there's no traps. Okay, cool. Jeez. So wait, I go, I go into this room, or because I was going to go yeah. through this door here. Oh, you can go through that instead. It's up to you. Yeah, I was going to go through this door here. The top oh, I want to kick mine Sorry, down. Google's talking to me. <laughs> yeah, it just looks like this is where the goblins would stay to guard the front entrance. It's just got an arrow slit here. Nothing too impressive. Okay, cool. I'll I'll join in here just be like well let's see how how let's see how well your luck holds up with this room um i can't do i can't say that ooh, beds. <laughs> I, I don't know um uh yeah you so you see you walk in you see crust with like a suit of armor a cask of <laughs> ale over his shoulder it's just like oh hey, oh, hey. <laughs> just like you know who would really love that cask that that ale gundrin he was just asking me about that Oh, well, we're not just asking. Well, no, last was... night, but I mean... <laughs> I mean, I was going to give it to the boys, but I guess he can He can. Have well, it. I mean, it's big enough that I think we can all share it, right? Let's go get lit. <laughs> um, was that a turn back then? In this it room, <laughs> in this room, when you look through, you can see it looks like there were people staying in this room, but there's lots of weapons in this room. There's spears, swords, morning stars, and more. Um, Any green sword? significant value there are five spears four long swords three morning stars two great swords and a really really nice looking quarter staff i grabbed it's the great. quarter staff it's engraved with like stylized feathers and it is really light like it's Ooh. like a pound like it's surprisingly light i'm pretty sure i can use quarter staffs you can i do okay they're i'm gonna very... take the quarter staff then nice regular great swords yeah they're just regular great swords but you're not there <laughs> yeah yeah, okay. Yeah. 
can I, can I check what's in here? It's probably just going to be the same thing as what this is, but... You're wrong! Just... No, you're right. <laughs> shows, shows what you know. It's a trap! <laughs> How do I add the weapon? You go to the I, the, the letter I, on the... on the yeah. room, And then the type search. in order stuff? Yeah. And then drag and drop the item, not the proficiency. Just drag and drop the item onto your character sheet. Item. Okay. Cool. Did it work? Oh, I like Carlisle's new picture. Yeah, because I I figured that it like the old the new one is much more Look at him. akin to my character Ooh. than it is to because my character oh. isn't not isn't actually like dark and depressing. So I'm like I got to find a better picture. So while I was writing up his backstory, I found that it's not uh, it's not working. Um, here I'll do it for you. Are you dragging the proficiency? I'll be able to tell when I check no, your sheet. I'm dragging the item. The item. Are you dragging the bees? Quarter staff. Items. Okay. Oh, there. Six of them just added. Oh, awesome. I'm going to delete a bunch of them for you. I, I, I really like playing D&D with you boys. Oh, like same. That. There you go. It's got a one-handed and a two-handed. And then in your inventory, oh, you have a bunch. Just make the quarter staff. I should put my, my blue light filter glasses on. I haven't had those on this whole time. The quarter staff? I have my own the entire time. I just have sure, work on the entire time. Quarter staffs are there yeah. for me Super for the attacks and spellcasts. It doesn't work? No, no, no. They're just gone. They were there, but they're gone now. Oh. Okay, let me try one more. Right. just got to clean them. Cool. Huh. Oh, so it does the same as my spear. Yep, except it's bludgeoning instead of uh, pier uh, piercing. Does the it being light do anything extra, or is it just like a fun fact? It's just it's just kind of it's worth a little bit of money, probably. You could probably sell it because it's probably a little bit magical. Um, Drothgar, like Drothgar and Zathira, as you guys are all doing that over here. Drothgar and Zathira, you guys make your way back to Gundren, who's, you see him, like, kind of stretching and getting ready. He's like, oh, I can't wait to get back on the road and get back to Vandalin. Hi. Um, <laughs> it's gonna be... Can we, I... can we tell him all about Sildar and how we rescued him from the goblins and... Sure, you want to tell him all that? Yeah, so you yeah. spend the next little bit telling him the story of everything that's happened so far and the, the red brands and Vandalin and glass staff and how you found the note about the black spider and yeah all and this and ask him can we ask him about the black spider because he's wanted by them like he, that's the whole reason why he was captured yeah um he kind of sighs and he says i it's a uh, it's a strange thing it is <sighs> give me a moment so i can open up all my information <laughs> um, <laughs> he had mental rolodex just <laughs> <laughs> Meta gaming. He says, uh, well, uh, you see. Well, the DM can get away with it, though. He's yeah, I'm allowed. To, allowed I'm the one that I'm allowed to metagame. He, to metagame. he I is the metagame. metagame. <laughs> I am the game. I am the game. Lost. And he says, uh. Oh, no. He says, well, you, you know, by this point, you probably figured out that me and my brothers, uh, Nundro and Tharden, were, uh, we were, of course, trying to discover Wave Echo Mines, you know, the, the, the old mines in Phandalin. And our goal was to reclaim it for the clan and reestablish the mine, but you know, it looks like this black spider fellow has been uh, following us around. I don't know very there? much. Oh, wait, I'm not there. Hoo, hoo. I don't know. Hoo, hoo. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, much more than that, but it seems like this black spider fellow wants to get wanted to get me map from the goblins here. You see that King Grohl? He was he was being paid to bring me and me map to to that that drow lady, but uh, I don't know anything more than that. Are you are you That's Scottish or are you a pirate? I am both. I am. <laughs> if... Can't you? Be, I was gonna say, can't you be both? I'm pretty sure you can, or at least according to Assassin's a Creed Scottish Rogue, pirate. you can. I have a very inconsistent accent, but you know, I step into pirates. Every... You, you have to understand. You see, the man who's doing my voice, he. Uh, Everybody's on a pirate ship in the game he runs tomorrow. Right now, they're literally on a pirate ship, so it's hard to... It all blends. Oh, that's it's always fun. Ship, ship mechanics? That's always fun. Why? 
So I'm going to try to keep the Scottish accent now. I really apologize for it waver in that match. All right, stay to your roots. That that drow that wanted your map wasn't actually your drow. <clears throat> she wasn't. It was a doppelganger. I've never heard of such a thing. Well, that's not true. I've definitely heard of such a thing, but that's ridiculous. Yeah. I wonder why. It, I wonder why it was like that. That that I mean, it doesn't really answer anything. It just kind of raises more questions. But you're not wrong. <laughs> Maybe she was turned into a drow so that she wouldn't be asked any more questions. I don't. Well, who who just like flung a? Oh, never mind. Yeah. Never mind. Um, would I be um, would I be able to make as their conversation is happening? Can I make my way at least over to the door? Yeah, you guys over can. There. You guys can start making your way back down the Yoshi, door. Yoshi, I'm assuming you as well are moving back. Out of the way. Yes, sir. Yeah. So <laughs> are you I, for me? Oh, okay. So, yeah, because you you guys told your whole. It took you a long time to tell that whole story. So yeah. I, I, eventually, these guys show up. Cool. I want to wow. give Gundren um, <laughs> the the stuff I found, so he can give the it alcohol. back. To he says, "Cause we're not going straight back, right? Oh. We're doing a big circle thing." Yeah, yeah we're belongs to Sildar. Yeah. yeah. Well, thank you kindly. I don't know what I do without it. He'll be very happy to see it. <laughs> what about? Hey, uh, Mister Heads, is that a giant keg of alcohol I see? It is a giant keg of alcohol, you see. Ah, uh, just what I was looking for. <laughs> I lean <laughs> over. <laughs> Told you. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys want a party, Hardy? This calls for some bagpipes. Whoops! <laughs> 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 the bagpipes. Make a bagpipe check, please. <laughs> Do it. What is it again? Is it performance? Christmas? Yeah, per performance. Performance. Yeah, it's in your skills. Uh, quick bagpipes, attribute... Oh, charisma, you're right, yes, charisma. It's a pretty good... It's not like that first night where you guys were moved to tears, <laughs> but it, it's a very good... It's very, uh, very goody. Do we get a little, do we get a little, little dance, a little two-step while you're doing it? Yeah, so you guys... Are, you guys... Guns are gonna bust a move while, like, pounding back shots. <laughs> of course. This is great. Can you guys hear the children outside? A little bit, but uh, not not really. I agree. Oh, okay. As long as it's just, like, mellow. It's fine. Let's dance, everybody. <laughs> 170 <laughs> feet of making. movement. <laughs> While playing the bagpipes. The only thing you're missing is the unicycle. <laughs> All right. Uh, cool. All right. Are we, um, are we done here? Well, uh, yeah, I, I guess so. Yeah, Gundren, are, are are we good to meet you back at Fandolin, or do you want to accompany us on the rest of our journey? Wait, I have to play the music. Oh, oh, he's got he's got music. Yeah, yes. it, sounds, it, it doesn't sound quite like bagpipes, but just pretend instead of a flute, it's bagpipes. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think I think we should I think we could spend another night here partying it up. Did you guys really just spend a whole day and night oh, partying? Yeah. <laughs> That's nothing favorite. bad could possibly party. happen. Yeah, wanna, nothing could happen. I want to uh, grab onto Drothgar's arm and do that like the circle dance jig thing. Like, <laughs> yeah, like, can we like can we do the thing in a little square? I have bagpipe music as well, but it's like club bagpipe music. Please play it. <laughs> Are you ready? It's called Club Sheamus. <laughs> oh, this is sick. This... I, don't know, I don't know where the 808s are coming from. But it's... Is this party counting as a long rest? I mean, you're not gonna get. You can't get two long rests like within like eight hours of each other. Like it's. Oh, I wanted to turn into a camel and dance. <laughs> you guys take a bit to. Uh... This is just. So, are you guys actually gonna stay another whole day and night, or are you guys just gonna party for a bit and then hit the road? Uh, part... Party and hit the road. Just party. party. All right. hit the road, yeah. So you guys party for a bit celebratorily. Gundren gets down with the best of it. Um, he he's he's just happy to be free. Um, Yoshi's dancing on the table. 
I'm loving yeah. it. Yeah. He's rolling, rolling on the table. He's rolling on the table. And um <laughs> I, Whoa, before, so well, good. I was gonna, I was gonna say, I did, I did have a question for Gundren really quick. Sure. Uh, Gundren. Um, sorry, I hate to bother you, my friend, but um, I don't suppose. Do you remember? No um, bother. Okay. <laughs> What'd you say? He said, "This is no bother." Oh, okay. This I thought you no said, bother. "Don't bother." I was like, "Oh." <laughs> no, no. Uh, well, yeah, zoo for you, friend. Do you do you happen to remember a uh, companion of mine? Um. Uh, crystal by any chance? Uh, maybe briefly. I you met. She's the big metal one. Yes, she's the big metal one. She joined us on the pub crawl. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You know her, yeah. So. What I, about her? I take it that you haven't seen her as of late, have you? Oh no, I've been far too busy working with me brothers. Oh, okay. Okay. No, no. Just th just thought I'd ask. I I haven't seen her in a very long time, so I I was just <laughs> curious. If it's dear again, you'll be first to know. <laughs> thank you, thank you very much. And uh, with that, the partying continues for a little bit before eventually you guys start to hit the road. So Gundren is going to walk. You guys give him an idea of where he is, and you guys are going to walk. He's going to walk back to Fandolin. Mm -hmm. Are you guys going to go with him, or are you guys going somewhere else? Um, I think we from, from what I understand, last time we played, I. I think our plan was to go to Thunder Tree, then Agatha's Lair, and then back to town. And then back. Um, no, there was one more place we wanted to go. That was the uh, Wyvern Tor is where the orcs are. Yes. Yeah, right here. Um, the other thing that Gundren says before he leaves is, "When you're ready, I'm gonna head back to Fandolin, and then I'm gonna get Sildar, and we're gonna head towards Wave Echo Cave." Okay, we, uh, so are we meeting? Are we going to meet him at Wave Echo Cave? Or are we gonna I'll meet, meet you there. Well, okay, okay. <laughs> maybe not. Actually, here's here's the best bet. I'm probably going to stay in Fandolin, wait for my brothers to show back up. But at that time, we'll probably meet around Wave Echo Cave, or you can meet us in Fandolin. We'll be in the area. Okay. So uh, we'll see what happens. But wait, you feel free to go there, because who knows what madness is crawling around there with these goblins about, and they had me, they had me map for a while, so it'll probably be best if you, uh, if we go you head in there the first, anyway. For you. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't mind. <laughs> There's some extra gold in it for us? Oh, for sure. Oh, yeah, but... Listen here, he extends his arms, he says, if we get this cave going, we'll be rich. I like that. Oh. I like this idea. <laughs> <laughs> Says, I wish you all the best. Oh, trust the least amount of money. <laughs> and uh, yeah, t take care. And I know you said that Sildar plan to he planned to give you some some money when you made it back to Fandolin. So if you want to get that money before you head to the cave, I'll totally understand. Um, but I'll I'll see you boys around and you, Mister Theater, of course. And he like gives you a bow. I hope y'all I'll have the. Uh, I'm gonna spank his bottom. Safe <laughs> journey. He kind of. It, 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 it is not just a light little, it's a loud. <laughs> it's it's a yeah. full on bolts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll uh, I'll see you all around. Take care of yourselves. And with that, Gundren hits the road and starts heading towards Fandolin. I'm gonna miss that guy. Yeah, yeah. good guy. Are Hopefully we uh... get captured on the road again? Are we <laughs> on the road again? <laughs> He gets captured I, I and like he beat, ends up beating us to Thunder Tree. Playing the bagpipes. There we go. Sorry, yeah, I've been just playing the bagpipes. Hey, don't in apologize the background for this whole don't apologize for bagpipes. Yeah. So are you guys gonna head? Sorry. So where are you guys heading next? I know there was a few plans. There was Thunder Tree Thunder and then Tree. over to Agatha's Lair yeah. and then Wyvern Tor. Down through the mountains to Wyvern Tor and then back to the road and back to Fandolin and back to Wave Echo Cave. <laughs> wow. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah, let, exactly that. <laughs> exactly that. <laughs> All right, so you guys hit the road and start heading towards Thunder Tree. Yes, because I want that amulet. So from where you are, Thunder Tree is about 25 miles away, which is a full day's travel. So you guys will travel and probably camp just outside of Thunder Tree before actually arriving in Thunder Tree proper. Mm -hmm. Um. While you guys are walking, does anybody talk to one another? Anybody? What's uh? What, what, like, or are you guys stoic? Do you just listen to the bagpipes? <laughs> Do we just? <laughs> Is he still what, playing? What? Well, I, I would like to 
ask about Carlisle. Uh huh. Carlisle, yes, tell sir. me about yourself. Well, there's not really much to tell. Um, I I feel like I've been pretty transparent with the party. I uh, grew up on. I haven't. Uh, I haven't been paying attention. <laughs> 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 to be fair, I haven't really said said much anyway. Uh, well, there's not really much to tell. I grew up uh, living on the streets. Um, it's really all I've ever known. Um, besides that, so, no, I actually, I never knew my I, I never knew my mother. <laughs> Jeez, uh, never knew. I never she knew died my, before he was born. No, uh, I don't even know that for sure. I never, I never actually, I, I never actually uh, met them. All, all I know is that from a young age, I was dropped somewhere and and uh, living off of the streets. Ooh. Wow, that's all I really know. All right. At least, so, at least for my, at least for from from what I could remember from when I was young. From what you can remember. Well, you when you're when you're young, how much how much when you reach a certain age, how much do you remember of your childhood, really? True, true. That's true. Drothgar <laughs> stares off to the end of the distance with his PTSD flashbacks. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. Remembers everything. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that's enough of my question. I was gonna say, is there any more? No. Do you okay. want to talk to anybody else, or you're just yeah, <laughs> just Carlisle's the only person you're interested in. It's fine. I would ask about Yoshi, but he doesn't say anything. Yoshi. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, hold, 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 on. hold on, hold, hold the phone, hold on. Uh. <laughs> Let music me... just stops. No, no. <laughs> music just yeah. stops. Yeah. Uh, hold the phone. Hold the phone. Oh, record scratch. <laughs> yeah. Would, <laughs> which, would, would you consider is is Yoshi the only thing that he can say, or is does he have kind of his own language? Would you say? No, that's the only thing he can say because uh, basically watching his uh, wife and kids die, he's still traumatized. So that's the oh. only thing he can say. Okay, because I was gonna say I yeah. have I have comprehend languages. <laughs> yeah, <it's own> language. <laughs> and I was gonna and I was gonna cast comprehend language and just be like Yoshi, <laughs> Yoshi, Yoshi. Yeah. Yoshi yeah, he's the root of our group. Yeah, no, literally, because I'm 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 too traumatized still. So. It's only been a month. It's only been a month. Oh okay. my! Wow! He literally lost his wife and child a month before the game started. Oh, but this is this is this is this is all player knowledge, though. The player, the, the yeah, the you guys, you guys don't know, know that, this. but your characters don't know that. Your characters just have a meatball companion that you. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you just kind of don't know that. One day. <laughs> You're just like, oh Showing yeah, I got four people and a meatball <laughs> towards uh, <laughs> escorting this wagon, and he's just stuck around. So. You know, no, juicy meatball. Honestly, this flabby sack. Uh, anyway, <laughs> I wonder how scrotal he looks. Anyway. Oh. <laughs> oh. So has, has, has anybody shared their backstories? No, Zathira hasn't. Zathira hasn't. And neither is Drothgar. No, and, and I, I don't think Carlisle has shared his entire backstory yet. No, he's just. No, I, I had I had crust open up to me. Yeah, on our travel to Kragma. Yeah, that was very nice, uh, Mr. Hez. I feel like me and Mr. Hez, you know, grew a little bit. We bonded slightly, you know. I uh, definitely didn't try to kiss you then. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's after this kind of conversation, uh, and it's you know the new morning. You guys rest another night, and um. As the morning kind of creeps in and you guys continue making your way forward, you find yourself in a in a wooded area filled with fog. And you look down at your map and you look up and you know that you guys are in none other than the ruins of Thunder Tree. Bum, bum, bum. Why are we going here again? <laughs> because of the amulet. For, for what amulet? For, for, the amulet for Zathira. I'm the, just gonna pee really quick. The amulet that the mother who you suggested gave her your her daughter 
as reward. Oh, right. Oh, yeah. Oh, right. I forgot about that. <laughs> what a scumbag. Oh, my like, gosh. Oh, like no, time. but we have a uh, a family heirloom in Thunder Tree that you can have, not my daughter. Okay. Anyway. Okay, this is going to take me a minute. And you're right, absolute scumbag of a person. Oh! I am What'd you not do? scumbag. You don't know my backstory. <laughs> um, I don't need to know your backstory to know that asking for someone's daughter as a reward for saving their lives is a pretty scummy thing to do. That's a pretty fair trade, if I must <laughs> That's say. That's a pretty fair trade. <laughs> You should try doing that, David, just in real life. Save somebody's life and say, give me your daughter. <laughs> I demand it. I mean, depending, sure depending on... Two cows for someone's daughter. <laughs> there, there is a term for that. I forget what it's called. I think it's called bride, bride wealth or something like that. Where you trade X amount of stuff for the, the daughter's hand. Yeah, that's just her hand. So horrible. Yeah, it's just her <laughs> Have you seen that document documentary of like a country somewhere in the Philippines where you literally just abduct a wife and then she has to stay with you? Um, no, no that sounds like the. It's I it was I wasn't gonna say best at one point. It was crazy. All right, I'm gonna drop you guys into this map. Okay, heads up, this map is huge. Huge. Um, huge. You guys are gonna be teeny tiny on this map. <laughs> In the world. <laughs> no, no map has ever come close to this map. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's the best map. Dare I say it's the best map ever? This map is fantastic. <laughs> All right. Uh, so you guys, are, you guys are in map. here. Wow! Wow! That's a really good Obama. Uh, Thunder Tree is a uh, very good map. My fellow Americans. My, my fellow Thunder Treeans. <laughs> Okay, so holy cow. You guys are up here in the top corner and it is foggy and eerie and <laughs> just Rothgar. Just right uh, I again the picture that I posted on the chat is very prudent. The party walking into death like Yeah. <laughs> Alright, where then oh Oh who left? Welcome no, back. I, I, I didn't mean to do that. I wanted to I did the same thing. Um, what, what photo did you share, Zach? I don't see no photo. Uh, no, this was last week. Oh. The, one, the one of DiCaprio? The, like, oh. the Stratton DiCaprio party walking into death, like... Okay. Ah. I, thought, I thought you meant you just did it. I'm like, I don't see anything. <laughs> so, you guys, uh, oh, wow. there is a rough path headed through the ruins of Thunder Tree. Uh, and there's some buildings to your left and right. Uh, what do you guys want to do? Them. Yeah, I wanted to go explore there too, actually. So actually, let me let me read something to you to kind of set the set the tone. Uh oh. Gradually, oh, the trail. Gradually, <laughs> the trail becomes an old, overgrown lane, winding between dilapidated buildings choked in vines and brush. Ahead of you in the middle of the settlement rises a steep hill upon which stands a stone tower with a partially collapsed roof and an adjoining cottage. A dirt road hugs the base of the hill and, wi and wends its way up between the old stone houses, many of which are roofless ruins with interiors open to the weather. Other buildings be appear more or less intact. The whole place is eerily silent. A wooden sign is nailed to a post nearby. It reads, Danger! Plant monsters and zombies. Turn back now. Turn back? Yeah. Right. What, what are we doing here again? <laughs> <laughs> loot. We're here for the loot. <laughs> David. It was Maybe optional. <laughs> it was and a side quest. <laughs> the optional quests tend to give the best rewards. You don't know that. All right, let's explore. What if you find an enchanted longsword? Or a greatsword, great sword. rather. Okay, let's... Uh, yeah, okay. Okay, hang on. Party vote. Do you want to go to this house first or this house? Uh, The one to our right. Uh, the, sorry, uh, the, 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 the one to our right. What am I this thinking? This one? This one's closer. 
Yeah, I was gonna say this. Do one you want to explore there. this one then? Yes, let's sure. do this. There's also another building there. There's about, two buildings over here. Yeah, yeah. There, I, I think there's one there as well. But divide and conquer. Okay, so as you step there, Carlisle. Oh. oh you too, Drothgar. You you decided to run up with him. You're gonna face the wrath. <laughs> right, so covering in the shadow of an old tree, or cowering in the shadow of an old tree, is a crumbled. <laughs> is a crumbled. <laughs> Cottage with no roof. Weeds are rampant here. Uh, and as you step up to the front door, um, make a perception check. With advantage? What? Nope. <laughs> nope. Um, nope. Carlisle, <laughs> you, you look around. Shoot, I did a bad. Give me a second. <laughs> I did a bad. <laughs> I gotta zoom them. in on my character here. Just so I can see this much better. Sorry, uh, I have to make a quick... Did you guys see that? Nope. Oh, you don't notice anything. Yeah, there's oh. a door in front of you. <laughs> there's a door in front of me. <laughs> I... <laughs> Alrighty then. Take <laughs> down door. No. Uh, I... No. <laughs> I, I check if the door is unlocked. It is. Okay. Uh, um, I, I've accepted my fate. I will slowly creak the door open. Uh, can Okay. You see a destroyed manor, just completely a mess, a ruin. Terrible. It's, it's horrible. Okay. Vines and twigs everywhere. Okay, that and uh, I, mm, I, I kind of want to, I kind of want to ser search the house to see if there's anything of value in here. Sure, go ahead and make an investigation check. And the rest of you, if you want to move while he's doing this, feel free. I'm backing you up, buddy. <laughs> uh, you look around the room, nothing of interest here. Okay, and then I, I just make my way out and just like there is nothing in there let's let's there's also on. there's an opening here i don't know if that's clear but that that is an opening into this building as well okay yeah um, because um, we're standing like over here do we get to see more of the map or like are we able I, to see I will show you the map as it becomes relevant <laughs> oh, um, there's wow. fog you can probably see like down here a little bit more I love how Yoshi's just like. Yeah, Yoshi's just chilling, chilling back there. I take out my longbow I, and he's scanning the horizon. He can sit there. He can hit things from like 600 feet away. He don't need you. I'm I'm rolling down the path. <laughs> he's cleaning up the the gardens and the weeds and everything. Yeah, I'm um, eating them. Do you want to inspect this house? Then? I was gonna say I should we really sac really sac <laughs> Let's let's sacrifice the rogue. How's that? And I will make my way and kind of peer around the corner see if there's anything in there i've got your six uh i got range i can i can cast firebolt at 130 feet so i'll stay here sorry just give me one hot second guys there's something on this map that's confusing me and i just want to double check i'm gonna give you a cold second how's that the lukewarm man must be must, be must be must be nice being able to shoot up to like 600 feet and then like 130 feet whereas my chromatic orb is, orb is 90 yeah and that's from throwing yeah, but power. if i want to do burning hand it's only 15 from me so like but i mean like that's not even like with a weapon i'm just taking that diamond and throwing it as hard as i can <laughs> yeah, you're just yeeting that diamond <laughs> magic yeet Although, 90 feet that's a long ways like that's from you like, that, that's 85 right now. You still have a long throw. <laughs> you know? I just look off in the distance and I see, like, some sort of enemy is just like, hold my beer. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, though, Yoshi can go 600 feet, so he could literally shoot from corner to corner of this map. So, uh, <laughs> Carlisle. Yes, sir. When how'd you learn to check traps so well? Well, like I said, I like I I, I did have people in my life. That, I did have people in my life that kind of taught me some 
tricks of the trade, but I didn't have one mentor. I just kind of learned by watching. <laughs> when you when you run into so many traps, you learn to. Watch <laughs> <out for> <laughs> Are we good to continue? Um, yeah, sorry, yeah, sorry. Are you going in here, Droskar? Uh, Carlisle's going in there, and I'm... I've well, I... Because I, I, uh, you said that there's an opening. I figured there wasn't a door there, so I, I said I yeah, peer, so I peer around the corner, see. yeah. You can see this. It looks so like these ruined side-by-side -by -side cottages. You can see it's next to another building over here, right? They look as though they might have been homes of a prosperous shopkeeper or well-off farmers in their time. Mm -hmm. All the remains are collapsed walls and piles of debris. And there are several young trees that have grown up in the midst of these ruins. Okay. Hmm. Um, I, 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 I'll search the, the room. To... Was it, I'm going to step, inside? Family, I'm gonna step inside, yeah. So as you step inside, <laughs> there's a... <laughs> noise and you watch as out of the vines and the trees these little buggers so i have to move you out so i can't well, at least uh... it wasn't at least it wasn't a trap what 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 what, what, what? <laughs> and you just see carlisle looking around just like i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry like <laughs> these little why, like why did these things pop up before because they were hiding. Oops, you guys can now see the giant number two. <laughs> oopsie doop, oopsie poopsie. This is. <laughs> we're gonna end this session in combat again. <laughs> no, you see these, like these... Whoa, Drothgar, get back over here. <laughs> no, Drothgar, you're in this with me, bud. Come on. Get back over here. You <laughs> see these twig creatures crawling through the walls, and they just kind of make this. <laughs> noise as they oh. jump out and start attacking you. Oh. Guys, we're gonna have to roll some oh, Initio Tavio. <sighs> Make sure Don't you forget click the... on your character. Yep. Oh, no, that's not bad. That's probably the highest... Uh, oh! Initio... Uh, has stakes in front of me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Right on cue. Hey, look at that! That's probably the highest edition of I've ever... <laughs> and has took it from me. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I'm so proud of myself. Whoa! Whoa! Yoshi! Yoshi! Yoshi's, Yoshi's here to play! <laughs> did you click your tracker? Yeah, he did. I did. Okay. He's there. He's in the tracker. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, Alright, Yoshi. You see these you see these twig monsters. Oh shoot boy. These, these twig monsters. my Lombo, man. These are called twig blades, and they jump out and they look like they're about to attack your friends. What do you want to do? Let them kill my friends. No, I'm kidding. Okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> I get it. Uh, I'll pull my Lombo to the guy closest to me. So this one? on my left, yeah. Yep, go for it. Cool beans. Cool, cool beans, beans, cool beans. You shoot it, the arrow hits the twig blade, it slams through oh, the wall and shatters into a bunch of little pieces. Yes, let's go. Yeah. Oh, these things are weaklings, okay. They're, they're basically say the same thing as goblins, because goblins Yeah, are like weak. twigs, man, they're twigs. Literally, they're twig blades. All right, do you want to move at all? Uh, no, I'll stay where I am. I didn't mean to move them, <laughs> so sorry. Oh, whoa! Disappeared. <laughs> I was trying to gauge my he distance. He disappeared into the fog. Happened. He's like, I'm out, boys, uh, I'm done! If you, if you go on the left, Colin, for your distance, um, the there's a circle with a stick in it. That's a ruler, so you can click on it and drag, make some lines. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh. Okay, uh, Crest, you are up. Pew, 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 pew. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move to him, because he's 30 feet. Well, can I cut across the grass? Is that Yeah, of course, yeah, of course. Uh, yeah. Just I'm grass. Move... Oh, wait, if you're gonna on. move, you have to click on the pointer yeah. arrow again. Move to him. I'm gonna try out my new quarter staff. Oh, you're gonna boop him? I'm gonna boop Ooh. him with the two-hander. Alright. You go to full baseball swing at him with the stick, and it just <laughs> ducks underneath, and there's a whiff noise as you strike one. <laughs> <laughs> The just swing best. wide. Do you want to use your bonus action to do anything, or no? Um, nah, I'm just gonna chill there. Alright. Carlisle. 
There's a lot of these bad boys coming through the walls over here and stuff. It's not looking great. Yep. I will... Mm. Uh, there's still a guy. Ah, uh, no, no. I, I'm sure... Uh, actually, no. Um, What? Sorry, I'm thinking to myself. Um, Carlisle tends to speak out loud, like, well, I could do this, I could do this. No, I can't do that. It's too close. Uh, well, what about this? No, I can't do that. Um, <laughs> I'm just staring at him like... <laughs> I will. Stab it. <laughs> well, it looks like these two are behind a wall. Can I get them, or is the is the wall these covered? Ones? Yeah, they have about half cover because the wall. Yeah, there is a wall, okay. but there's holes in the wall, like it's dilapidated. In fact, you can probably see. I'll just reveal the whole thing because you can probably see through the cottages. <laughs> for the most part. <laughs> there's, oh, there's more. more. Nice, nice. Okay, I, I I look at Drothgar and I'm just like, you got this, right? <laughs> if you help me yeah all right i uh, well i mean i'm better at range than i am at close combat i feel but anyway right. i will take <laughs> i i'm not going well yeah i'm going i'm going to take my chromatic orb out again <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm, I'm loving this spell and toss it at the one in the corner okay so uh, it is a ranged spell so you because you're in melee with this one that's right you'll have this that's right I but you can bonus that. action disengage Okay, yeah. I bonus action disengage and move over here. Yay, rogues. <laughs> and yeet my diamond at, at this at this one. Uh, if it hits, I'd like it to do fire damage. Okay. Ooh, because it doesn't hit. <laughs> it doesn't hit, but the fl it's still a flaming damage. It's still You have to do the element as part of the attack. So you throw the flaming like, the diamond, and as it moves forward, it catches fire and slams into the wall. You watch as some of the tree, the vines catch on fire, but the the blade kind of looks over each other and goes and is unhit. And but it doesn't look happy that you set the wall on fire. <laughs> okay. Um, I will... Um, how much movement was that? That you watch. <laughs> that, that was, so I've still got 20 feet of movement. Uh, you're going to see something weird. Hold on. There we go. Um, so I will move over here behind the wall. Okay. <laughs> Smart. Did you just like, breathe fire? Like, what was that? Yeah, I can do that. Yeah, I have he... lots of magic powers. <laughs> I have he Nova. Is... What does this do? That's the, that's the overseer for you. Nice. I can spatter. Ew. That's gross. <laughs> what does that holy like do? Blood effect. <laughs> Why is holy like... Ooh, holy fire. Whoa. Burning holy hellfire. <laughs> Ooh, death fire. Ooh. <laughs> blood. <laughs> I'm just I'm just finding out I can do all this, guys. Magic. Ooh, it's gay pride. <laughs> frost. Yes. Next time you use your frost breath, I'm gonna animate it. All right. Anyway, sorry. Continue. My apologies. Uh, Twig Blight's turn. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Hey, golly, jeez. Uh, of course. Ow. Oh, bitch. You wanna go? <laughs> Uh, of course. Oh. Hey, you're the tank. You want to get hit. Oh! Uh, okay. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Uh, I'm going to start at the top and mark my way down. Zathira. It's going to make a claw attack. Natural one. It misses. Crest. Yeah. It's going to make a claw attack. It's 17 to hit. Uh, It does, in fact, hit me, yes. You take two points of piercing damage <laughs> as, it pokes, as it, it pokes you with its sticky <laughs> bits. <laughs> Drothgar, three of them are going to attack you. Yeah. That's a 13, a 13, and a 12. No, none of them. Okay, they just can't... You just dodge them, and they hit your skin, but their twigs break against your hearty, <laughs> muscly body. Twigs. <laughs> and then... Yeah, with your with your muscles. Um, <laughs> And then, Carlisle, two of them are going to attack you. That's an 11 and an 11. None of them hit me. Yeah, you just dodge them and say, yeah, 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 I try to hit you. <laughs> They order, order, order you, but it doesn't work. Um, all right, Zathira, you are up. That's me. Um, there's no point in me trying to move, because I don't want yep. to take unnecessary damage. So what we're going to do is we are going to cast Firebolt on the guy right in front of me. Okay, it's a disadvantage. Um, that's okay. It was a natural 20. Yeah, but it's a disadvantage, so you take oh, the second one. It's a 7? Okay, well, then I'm going to use my... 
uh, other ability. There's so to use my where is it? Uh, um, empowered spell. Do I just click? No, it or just re that's a reroll. That's a reroll damage. Oh, it's re reroll damage. Not to hit. Oh. 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 Oh, crap. oh yeah. <laughs> but yeah, but your other one you could do is like your twinned spell, which lets you shoot it at two people. You know what I mean? You have to declare that before you cast the spell, but okay. Yeah. Well. Wow. So you, you you try to shoot the fireball, but he's right up in your face, so he just kind of pushes your hand out of the way, and you're unable to launch it right at him. I guess alternatively, I could have used burning hands because that wouldn't have given me a disadvantage. Correct. Well, this no, is how we learn how to durinder. That's correct. Yep. It would really nice though to hit that nat twenty. Yep, it would have been, but you didn't. You failed. <laughs> All right, Drothgar, <laughs> you're up. I am going to great sword this boy. All right. <clears throat> Saving my rages. And these guys seem a little yeah, just wakes. Oh. You swing down and just clang, you hit the stone, unable, you just don't hit the guy. Nice. Alright, let me get some goes, food while the rest of the combat is going on. Alright, Yoshi, you're up. Man, everything's so small. Uh, you can zoom in on the right hand side. Oh, plus shoot, minus there we go. Sick. Yoshi, longbow the guy in front no, of me. No, literally, I'll longbow the guy in front of me. Yay. Alright. Oh yeah, that's another one down. Yoshi's got a good kill count going. Yeah, let's go. Double kill, bro. One. Turns to the next one. Two. Just Yoshi's easy. Yoshi's AD is off yeah. the and then, and then I'll, uh, I'll roll up right here. Alright. Beside my good booty friend. I'm gonna I'm slap him on his booty and say thank you. With with his booty. <laughs> and I'm gonna all his booty with my tail. Oh shoot! We, All right, we, crust. We, when that happens, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go happens, for the the quarter stop again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the booty meets the meatball. <laughs> uh, all right. What are you gonna do, crust? Sorry. I'm going for the uh, quarter stop again. All right. You start spinning it around like a superhero, and whack! You cannot hit the thing. You just oh swing right over top of its head, unable to connect. You're hitting wood with wood. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't work very well, Carlisle. Oh, do you want to move at all? Um, I'll, I'll move. Not you, not you, sorry. Um, Crest, did you want to move? Oh, hi, Colin. Colin? Uh, no, sorry, I'm good. All right, Carlisle, you're up. All right, <clears throat> I will take out my short sword and attempt to uh, cleave this, it, this one in half. Let's see. Chop that wood. Literally. And you do. You swing down at it, and it just breaks into pieces as you swing. So, right. do they basically just have 7 HP then? <laughs> that's all you know. That's all, that's all we know. Uh, <laughs> with this one being a so, wall apart yeah. from me, will it still take attack of opportunity if I move? Uh, it'll, you'll have, like, half cover. Three, well, three quarters I can, cover. I can still bonus action disengage, right? Yeah, you can. Yeah, so I bonus yep. action disengage, and I will move. Actually, and you're there, Carlisle, so you can see all this. Okay, no more, no, no new enemies. We're good. Uh, <laughs> There's just like seven of them in there. <laughs> just can't see all this. Ah! Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> all will, right, there you go. So I will bonus action disengage, and I will move to the corner here. Um, yeah, that's pretty much okay. it. Cool. It is now the twig blights' turns. More like the gay blights. Oh, he, just uh, <laughs> he just follows me. He saw me take his buddy out. He's like, no. no. <laughs> They're hungry. Um, uh, crust. Natural 20. Oh. <laughs> you're like, yeah, doesn't it? No, you're like, you're like trying to swing at it. And as you like swing over top of its head, you leave your underarm like exposed. And it just jabs a twig right up between your ribs. And it just. You feel this like twinge of pain. You take eight points of piercing damage. Oof. Um, That's a lot of damage. <laughs> all right, damage. Carlisle, yes, the sir. sticks to hit. Does what? A sticks. It does no, not it hit. No, it doesn't hit me. <laughs> and then against Drothgar, 
Oh my goodness, I rolled so bad. Against Drothgar, I rolled a 7, a 7, and an 8. <laughs> I just can't hit Drothgar, apparently. Alright, Zathira, you're up. Okay, now, what we're... Ooh. So here, here's an interesting question. With my meta magic, can I use Twinned, and if I don't like the damage, then reroll the damage as well? Empowered is the only one you can do that with, yes. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna twin twin magic my uh, my firebolt. So I'm gonna cast firebolt on Hya and Hya. Mm -hmm. What's the other one? Okay. Um, make sure you mark off the right number of um, sorcery points. Yeah, I, th I think it just costs me one to use. If you if you click on it, it'll pop up in the chat, and we can see like the little uh, speech bubble next to it. Um. Yeah, equal to the spell's level, one sorcery point of the spell's a cantrip. So yeah, so one. So just one. And then we're going to cast... So I click Firebolt twice then, right? Yep. So the first one will be uh, the first one will be the top one, second one will be the bottom one. Oof. Okay, so the first one does not hit, but the okay. second one slams into yeah. it, it bursts into flames and just rolls away. It is dead. <laughs> it, All right. it is dead. It's happening. Yeah. Uh, Zathira just burnt one up in front of you. Uh, so make sure you mark off your one sorcery point, okay? Alrighty. Why, well, thank All you, right. Zathira. Oh, I, I tried to kill two of them for you, but I'll... I'll wow, you, first. Do you yeah. want to move, Zathira? Um... Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna... I'm just gonna move... Like, right over here. Okay. Uh, man, David, you're back just in time, because it's Jrothgar's turn. Cool. I'm gonna great sword this guy. <laughs> there you are, with your mouth full. What'd you get, a peanut butter sandwich? One, no other way. Yeah, man. I just realized my family hasn't texted Oh! Me. Jeez, if you crit. Look how much damage you would have done if you crit. 14 Damn. plus 9. Wow. But you, uh, you didn't crit. You only do 14 damage. <laughs> that would have only, only that would have said only 14. Double you, you turn around and just cleave the thing in two. It is very <laughs> dense. In twain. Yes. Oh, well, more than twain. Time. It's just a it's a pile of sticks afterward. Um. You all right. Uh, do you want to move at all? Or are you okay being next to this guy? No, move um, out of the way so I can get a clear shot at him, man. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, it's gonna take a free swing at you. What? Why? Because you moved out of its range, that's the rule. Oh, Attack shoot. of opportunity. Uh, roll the seven, <laughs> though, so you're okay. <laughs> cool. Alright, Yoshi, you're up. Alright. I'll move, like, right here. Oh, right next okay. to that one? So you have disadvantage. I'll this one. Okay. And then I'll shoot the one beside me. So, there's a wall between you now. Oh no, I'm at like, on, on my left. Oh, the one on your left. Oh, okay. So you made Jrothgar move for no reason. Cool. Alright. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Wow. wow. He's dead. Yoshi's Yo, kill triple count. kill, man. Yoshi's <laughs> kill count is climbing. Just Why boom, one shot, it turns. Turns around, boom, <laughs> two shot, it turns around. Boom, three shot, it shatters as well. Yeah, Yoshi's just dropping them like like twig blights. I'm proving my meatballness. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I, love the, I love the mental image of him shooting, rolling, shooting, <laughs> yeah. rolling, shooting. Out a victorious Yoshi. Yeah. Yoshi! Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Alright, right. right. yeah. Crust, you are up. Alright, I need to redeem myself here, so... Gotta catch up my kill count, bro. I'm gonna go to this one, and hopefully hit with the quarterstaff this time. This is still on top quarterstaff. Hey. Oh, you Finally. smash it. You just overhand swing and just bust it into a bunch of little pieces. Nice work. Thank just you. Dropping like flies. Carlisle, you're up. Uh, would there be enough for me to potentially shoot this one past the wall? Or not the wall from there. Enough? Not, not, no, wait, the wall is not okay. from there. All right, yeah, so I will... Yeah, you'll have to get, will... like, up here. Okay, well, I, I might as well just run inside then and uh, attempt to hit him with my short sword. Sure. And that is just hits, and they have four hit points. You run in, <laughs> and you cut it in half. Fresh, like fresh, fresh firewood three. tonight, boys. <laughs> Wow. And that is the end of combat. Good job, guys. The only person so, I 
Jesus Christ. You, you see Carlisle yeah, raise his like hand. 10. So you see Carlisle raise his hand and goes, that was on me. <laughs> <laughs> it's all your fault. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna move closer to the party now. Like, I I vote for bo- I I vote for burning all of this down. <laughs> Personally, <laughs> I'm gonna cast burning hands on the village. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Um, but we also still have a whole other. around. What do you want to do? We still have a whole other house to check out, and you see Carlisle. I just mean, have of... we have we technically explored this house? Like, you guys haven't searched the houses at all. If you'd like to. No. So wait. We haven't even searched this one, have we? No. You just can walked I, inside and got attacked. Can I roll perception or just... You can. Go ahead and make a perception check. Okay. Where's my perception here? That's deception. Perception. <laughs> yeah, for sure. It doesn't take you very long. You can see tied up among the roots in the back of the room. And everybody sees you find this because they're all there. I'm sorry. Except for Carlisle. Except for Carlisle. Uh, there is a chest wrapped up in in vines and stuff i open the chest (laughs) yeah you open the chest you find 90 gold pieces 160 silver pieces and 700 copper pieces wow okay so are you dividing it up or what are you doing with um yeah well since carlisle ran away um... (laughs) the poor guy has nobody already (laughs) I'll, I'll i'll be nice and i'll evenly divide everything except with crust no Oh, really? I'm just joking. I'll, I'll evenly divide it all. Okay. So everybody gets... I am just going to do the math really quickly. There's no items? It's like we didn't find the emerald No, just, just, just all the bills. It looks just like dollars. this isn't the house. Oh, that's fine by me. Okay, everybody gets 18 gold, um... 32, 32 silver, and 140 copper. 32, that put me at 104. And 140 copper, you said? Oh, it's right in the chat. <laughs> um, 70. So that's what. Don't forget to add to your money, folks. That Quick was, math. I apologize. That was how many gold? 30? It's in the, it's chat. In the chat. Oh, thank it's, you. Uh, gold, it. silver, copper, in that order. Thank you. Now, did my perception check count for this one, too, or not? Yeah, yeah. You searched both houses. Yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. And then Carlisle, you started walking up towards the other house. I did. I got a little. I got a little ahead of myself because I forgot I hadn't searched yet. But you know what? Whatever. <laughs> um, as you get closer, you reveal. That, that's uh, there. It is. You reveal more of the town, <laughs> except for this this tree. You can't see that tree. <laughs> <laughs> that what? I can't see the trunk of that tree. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so I will make my way up to the door, checking for traps. Make your way downtown, walking fast. <laughs> All right, my face is right fast, on. and I'm homebound. Yeah, I'm sure. gonna, yeah, I'm gonna behind, come behind him here. Yeah, Great. yeah. Carlisle's probably gonna get there well, well first, but you guys can catch up eventually. Crest, are you keeping up too, or are you staying back? What's in this room? Did we look at it? Yeah, my, yeah, my yeah, yeah. Check okay, for okay it. cool. Then yeah, I'll go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, cool, cool. All right. <laughs> All right, Carlisle, you make your way up to the door. Mm-hmm. Uh, no traps? Uh, would you like to make an investigation check? I would, yeah. Go for it. 25. Uh, it doesn't look like it's trapped. Alright, I will Is uh, see if the door is locked. Um, it is door. not locked. Alright, I will creak open the door. Okay, you open <laughs> the door. <laughs> Our weakest person open the door. <laughs> yeah. You should like back away and let a stronger person open the door just in case. Or just push me through the door. I can roll through it. Yes, but then if uh-huh. one of you gets killed by the trap, then we're down people to fight. Well, no. I mean, if, if you check the door for traps and there's nothing, then. So when you when you walk up to this, you see a weathered signboard by the door of this large building shows the faded image of a workhorse holding a flagon of ale. The building is sagging and dilapidated, but is more intact than the ruins across the road. As you step inside, Carlisle, you look in this room. It's an old, like it's fallen apart. But as you step inside, you hear this... And standing up from the ruins... You see <laughs> a Minecraft zombie? No. What? What's these the number four? Three? These four. Oh, and a giant number three. And a giant um, number three. 
<laughs> Whoops. Um, <laughs> they look like... I'll give you a bigger image, just to... Oh, there is no... They look like this. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Mm -hmm. A walking dead? Yes. <laughs> and they... they get a raise. <laughs> this is a dictator shit. And then oh, they... intestines are just like coral. Out of it. Coral. Yeah, you, you you hear one go coral. <laughs> people. Coral, I killed it's, you. It's gonna attack you. Uh, because of course it does. Do I have a minute to warn minute. the party? <laughs> yeah, you go zombies, zombies, and then. Uh, and Sorry, then guys, die. You guys are gonna have to roll initiative again. <laughs> and then oh, die. I don't like doing back to back combats like this because I find it uninteresting, but, but it is my fault. <laughs> you're getting attacked by Zambos, so that's how that's how she goes. Oh, you guys can see that. Hmm, not a fan of that. Not a fan at all. My initiative is trash. Cause you're trash. <laughs> Cause you're trash. <laughs> wow. Shut up, dude. Zambos are not great at initiative. Not gonna lie. That's well, they're fine. they're natural. They would be na are these now? Are these like the strap on their Nikes and hauling ass after us zombies, or the shambling zombies? No, they're like. <laughs> so okay. <laughs> strap on their Nikes? Did you say? Yeah, they 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 strap okay. on their Nikes and haul ass after us. Yeah, they're not they're not World War Z zombies. They're they're, they're not the they're not the twenty eight days later oh, zombies. I no. The I am legend zombies. Oh yeah. <laughs> well those are more vampires than zombies. You're not wrong. Okay, you don't have to get so technical. Alright. First person to act, Carlisle, you oh, see a Zambo. What would you course. like to do? I I kind of like Bonus an, action, ah! leave. Kind of, <laughs> kind of I just like disengage and no, I'm kidding. <laughs> I, well, I mean, like, as, as, in like a that. moment in a moment of fear, I take out my short sword out of its scabbard, but as I'm swinging it out, I take I try to swipe it at the zombie to my left. Okay. Let's see it. Could line them up in a line and I'll burn him. Uh, a zombie has eight armor class. <laughs> you... Wow. It sinks into its flesh. There's like a meaty... Uh, you, you hit it. Nice. Looks like it hurt a little bit. <laughs> Fine. I And then I bonus action disengage and run out the door. Okay. My goodness. Dro dro I'm pushing Drothgar out of the way. I'm sorry! <laughs> <laughs> you did what you could, buddy. I did it again! I'm sorry! <laughs> and then Yoshi right. and then pulls out his longbow. <laughs> yeah, I can I pull out my longbow? You can, of course. Um, I'll move over here, and then this guy get the guy in front of me. Alright, let's see it. Alright, let's do it. Natural 20, headshot. Oof. Boy! Jeez. You hit it. There's like a stinking, like a sucking noise as the arrow stinks into its flesh, and it just kind of uh, it keeps moving forward. Wow. Okay. Wow. So it looks like uh, it hurt, but I'm, it's, I'm assuming it's also the a eight plus four is the count for the next. That's if it crit. Okay. Yeah. So it's just eight. Okay. So so far we've done eleven damage to this guy. He's still standing. And he just. Uh, <laughs> All right. Uh, do you want to move again, Yoshi? Or do I'm picturing wanna... like its tongue hanging out, and sure. like, when I'll, it shakes its head, it's making that right. la sound. Okay. Yeah. All right, Crust, you're up. Uh, I'm gonna just run in there. I'm gonna hit them with my quarter staff. Okay. Of <laughs> all the things you can do. Oh, whack. You crack it over the head, and it kind of <laughs> it slumps for a second, and then just drags itself forward a little more. It looks like it's having a hard time staying standing. I'm gonna slowly back out. <laughs> okay, it's gonna take a free swing at you. I dare uh, it to. <laughs> All right, it's gonna make a slam attack. Slam! Come on and slam. That's and a stick to hit. It just kind of <laughs> whips its arm at you and doesn't hit you. We've done 20 damage, and this thing's still standing. Oh my god. All right, Zathira. Beefy boys. Um, fireball. <laughs> just <laughs> in the room middle in. of that, just smacked out of the middle of that room. room. Yeah, I don't. I don't have fireball. It's a third level spell. <laughs> um, fire, fire, fire bolt. bolt. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll, um, I'm gonna use another one of my spell points, and I'm going to twin cast fire bolt again on these, this guy, and this guy. 
Uh, <laughs> you okay? <laughs> okay, so one firebolt. No, nope. another firebolt. Ooh. Okay, so the first one doesn't hit, so it, that uh, one doesn't hit. I'm gonna. The, I'm the gonna back gonna one. It does hit. Remaining spell point to reroll the damage on that. You want to reroll both of those? Sure. Um, just remember, you you don't get you get those back. I think on a short rest. So. Yeah, or I can also for convert spell yeah spells into a point. That's true. Okay, so go ahead and reroll one d ten. Just write slash or slash two d ten, I guess. Slash r two d. Oh nope, not nope, nope, nope. That's much better. Slams into the one in the back. It catches fire, um, and it just kind of goes. <sighs> keeps moving forward at you. Yeah, bish, do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna move back here. <laughs> <laughs> He's yelling over his shoulder. <laughs> She's yelling over his shoulder, her shoulder, running. Good job, right. fish. <laughs> it is now the zombies' turn. This one's gonna move into the space and then back, and this one's also gonna move into the space and then back. So all four of them are going to attack Drothgar. Because <laughs> he's in the door, and they are zombies, so they are stupid. My goodness. All right, Drothgar, first attack. A five to hit. Nope. Eight. Nope. Natural 20. <laughs> nope. Yeah. And natural one. All right, so only one of them hits. Uh, it does six points of bludgeoning damage as it just slams its fist into your face. Jeez. What a dick. But that's all they can do. Um, I have an idea, guys. If you want to make path for me on my next turn, I can move up here and cast Burning Hands and hit all four of them. Uh, all right, Drothgar, you're up. Yeah, I'm going to basically do that. I'm going to great sword this guy and then move out of the way for Zathira. Okay. I'll cast it as a second level spell, too, and do extra damage. Great sword. Let's see it. Yeah. 11 hits. Okay. You sla you stab your sword into it, and the zombie collapses onto the ground. And then you watch it twitch. Oh. What? How much damage did you do? He did nine. Twenty nine damage in total. Eighteen. And you watch as the zombie stands back up. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just kind of, uh, All right, moving right over here. All right, it's gonna take a free swipe at you. Mm. That's a twenty to hit. That's a what? Twenty to hit. Yeah. You take two points of bludgeoning damage as it spanks you as you run away. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Carlisle, you're up. All right, I <clears throat> will. Mm. Sorry, excuse me. I'm eating jelly beans. Um. <laughs> Excuse me, eating jelly beans. <laughs> I love that. Uh, I will run back here. What? Hold on, let me check my. <sighs> I will yes. run back here and pot shot the zombie. Yep. With and he already used his reaction, so he can't swing at you. All right, go ahead and take a shoost. That's right. Let's I see keep, it. I keep forgetting about my bonus action. Mm -hmm. Um, where is it? There it is. Ding! The arrow sinks into its neck and it falls over. But <laughs> it, it twitches for a second and stands back up. <laughs> so, is is what's happening is like he's dying and then doing like a saving check or whatever? You don't know. We don't know. Uh, you have no idea. You just see the zombie go down and get back up again. Okay. Um, ain't never gonna keep him down. He gets knocked down. Um, <laughs> he <gets> up again. <laughs> ain't never gonna keep him down. All right, Yoshi, you're up. This Zambo right. keeps going down and back up and down and back up. What are you gonna do about it? <laughs> Pull it right at him. Pull up my Lambo. Yeah, yeah. Let's see this. Oh! Ten points of damage. Let's see if he makes it. He goes down. 
And this time it stays down. It twitches yeah, and it boy. stays on the ground. Yoshi's kill count goes <laughs> Yo, <laughs> okay, okay, bro. It gets back up. Do we helped! Move? I'll move over to the side here. Alright, oh. cool. Crusts. Um, can I just like peek in the door, hit him with my staff, and then peek out? <laughs> yeah, he, he'll make, he'll make a He'll take a swing at you if you do that, but yeah. Uh, you know what, then? I'll just kind of chill here. Actually, no, I'm going to move so I don't get hit by the thing. So you're not going to attack? Well, I mean... <laughs> okay. Wouldn't, couldn't you, like, move down and throw your spear? I could move... Well, can I hit this one, I guess, through the door frame? Yeah, it's got half cover, but yeah. Same, All right, yeah. same dude. I'll do that. Oh, that's got, that's no cover. You can just... Yeah, you can just do it. Okay. Alright, uh, roll that back. Nice. The spear goes sailing over its head and clatters into the back wall. <laughs> no effect. You basically threw it like horizontally instead of forward with like the point forward. You just like overhand threw a stick at him and it just doesn't do <laughs> anything. Uh, Alright. It's like when I try to throw a spiral with a football. Um, Alright. You gonna move it all? Oh, you already moved. Alright. Zathira. All right, so question: If I'm standing where Drothgar is, can I? I can hit all three of those with burning this hands. This is correct. Yeah. All right. Well, then, boys, you know what's happening. We are moving over here. We are going to cast Burning Hands as a second level spell. Oh, the biggest spell. The biggest spell. <laughs> Uh, they rolled a, I kid you not, zero on their dexterity saving throw because they have a minus two. To their decks. <laughs> <laughs> they definitely got hit. Uh, okay. Go roll so here we go. Cast level 2. We're going to submit that. Um, That's a lot of damage. That's 14 damage to all of them. Yeah, I'm not I'm so, not going to re-roll the damage. So this one... Okay, this one burns, goes down, and does not get back up. And these ones just take a lot of damage. They are looking not great. You can see them falling apart a little bit. Ash, like, seeking out of their, uh, seeping out of their skin. And now, and because, I'm, because I'm on Drothgar, I'm going to move... Uh, it took me 15 to get here, right? Ooh. 20. 20? So I have 10 feet of damage. Uh, so I'll move down here. 10 feet okay. of damage. Yeah, I have 10 feet of damage. All right, it is now there. you on me. <laughs> uh, All right. I'll mark off that I used a second level spell slot. All right, one is going to swing its its meaty arm at you, Crust, and one at Drothgar. Crust, that's a 21 to hit. Yeah. You take three points of bludgeoning damage, and Drothgar, that is a six to hit. So it, it hits you, but it just doesn't hurt. <laughs> um, all right, Drothgar, you're up. I want to try and cleave his head off. Let's see if you can. Hey, Rosa. Do that. Please hit, please hit, please hit, please hit, please hit, please hit. Oh, wow. Let me just check. Yeah, you cleave its head off its shoulders, it goes down, and it does not get back up. <laughs> it twitches, grabs its head, puts it back on. <laughs> puts it back on, and it can't back up. Right? It twitches. You see the body start to try to stand up without the head, and then it just falls over. All right, there's one more, Carlisle. All right, uh, has this one already been damaged? Oh yeah, it's all got burn marks all over it from Sathira. It's not looking great. Cool. I cast Toll of the Dead. Ooh. Oh, hold on. No. Hold on. You, you guys want it? Uh, it makes a Wisdom save, right? It makes a Wisdom save. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, it rolled a six. Okay, so it's got to make... So that's eight points of damage. Teen con save. It fo You watch as the Zombo is walking forward. You watch it... it uh, this bell noise echoes out. The zombie just face plants and twitches <laughs> and stays down. Yeah! <laughs> and I think as those zombies kind of collapse and fall around you and you guys look to this room to, to start seeing if there's anything of value inside, I think that is where we'll end the session. With you guys getting ready to start searching. Cool beans. 
Carlisle can open that door in the next session. <laughs> Six more zombies. Six. I, I, <laughs> I, might, I might. If, if you have a chance, uh, I, I think we all know that our backstories are on our thing, right? Yeah. On our bios. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, you can read those if you want. Oh, yeah. Dude, awesome. Dude. Just know... You, you, how are we handling backstories, by the way? Is, like, metagaming allowed with the backstories, or no? Yeah, so, no, the thing is, like, if you decide to say I've told everybody my backstory, then that's fine, but just remember, there's some stuff that your characters have said and some stuff that your characters haven't said, so just make sure that your your character reflects what he actually knows. Yes. No meta, no meta. No meta. No meta game. Guys, this was very fun. This was good. Very fun. I know. As per the huge. I'm glad we didn't all die a horrible death. <laughs> <laughs> I, I almost died. Almost. Not dying almost. is nice. You guys got a lot accomplished. You guys, yeah. are, you guys are... If you guys finish Thunder Tree, you'll, you'll get to level 4. Oh, wow. That's Boy. soon? That's soon? Yeah. Level... So, because there's not much left of this adventure, but... Because the v adventure ends... Like, when you finish Lost Minds of Fandelver, you will be level 5. Yeah. So, if you do Cragmaw and Thunder Tree, that'll give you enough XP to get to level 4. And then you'll do a lot of other stuff, but you probably... Yeah, but you, you will not get to level 5 until you finish, like, the adventure. And level 5 is when I get 3rd level spells, right? Yeah, level 5 is a big power spike. Level 5, I get Fireball. It's over 9,000! Fireball. <laughs> Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 beep.